Why couldn't it have been two? Believe in these podcasts. Yo. Did you send me the DMs? Uh, Twerk up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we going in. Yes. Literally. Yes. I don't know what camera's mine. Yes. This it's look? It's just the wide one. This one. Yep. So there's not two on. That one's just on wax. Okay, why? Because you don't like the close angles. Oh, I was about to say, what the fuck do you think <laughs> this is? Just on wax. L'Oreal is No, because he's this literally smarted. sometimes Twerk be putting that, the fucking it. shit in my eyeball. And I'm like, Tori, can you just back here. up just a tad? You got me too. Anyway, um, what's going on? Yo, what's going I'm on? I'm L'Oreal. This is your boy Wax. What's going on, y'all? So How y'all doing? yesterday I see some crazy shit. Mm. I was staying in the city. Okay. And I was getting on my Uber, right? And I've been wanting to tell this story because it's so crazy. I've never seen nothing like it before. The block is crazy, right? Like Always. there's a club here, mm-hmm. a restaurant here, another club. Saturday night is popping. Like, it's New York City. You get New what I'm York saying? Or Orla- or New York or New Orleans. Lit. You got one. little phantoms on the side. You got the Ubers. You got the cabs. Ooh, okay. I'm setting the mood. Mm-hmm. You see the security outside. So I'm pulling up, and I hear a ruckus. I'm like, what is this going on, right? So I look. What we got? And I see a girl booking down the street, right? Now, mm-hmm. she got on a silver dress, bitch. You know who you are. You probably watch the show. Yeah. She got on a silver dress, but now I'm catching the tail end. So my Uber driver's like, what's happening? The girl is running. So I'm like, you know, like, yeah. you know, if you see people running the other way and other people run too, then you run if you black. Get the fuck out of here. But yes. when you see just one person running, you stop and take your phone out. Or you look and be like, oh, what's that bitch on? still? Or what's that? You know what I mean? <laughs> That's not what you say. Who's so, after her? So I look. Hey, oh, yeah. There was a there was about three motherfuckers after her. I hope no men, but go ahead. Men. Yikes. So I'm she like, stole what something. is going on? So yeah. I noticed one of them was a security. Mm-hmm. Another one was like a Spanish man. And then it was a bitch. Dumb. So they all running after this bitch. So she's booking. She got her stilettos at Ooh. that. She looked nice. So I'm shocked. Yeah. Right? Thief. They damn near. She snatched the girl bag. That's what happens. She snatched the. This is on. <laughs> this is in the meatpacking district. Yeah, for this sure. Is my, this ain't no. The girl looked like she was going to the club. Yeah. She snatched that bitch. It was, a, it was an Hermes bag. Okay. She snatched it and she fucking booked down. I never seen With nothing. stilettos on. Uh, makeup done, hair yeah, done. Yeah, yeah. She was willing to go to jail for this Hermes bag. Is that not the craziest? For- oh, so look. So they catch her. Mm-hmm. They don't see no bag. So I'm like, did she put it up her pussy? I don't know. You know. <laughs> yeah, that. yeah, yeah. It's fat ass pussy. She threw it. Yeah. She threw it. So when they was walking, they was all looking around and they was like, there it is. She threw it in the corner. Mm-hmm. So they ended up finding it. But like. What the fuck would make you think to do some shit like it's that? It's cold out here. She probably got kids. She need the money. She's going to pawn it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. She was going to come up yeah, on that bag. Yeah, she's going to come up off the bag. I mean, a lot of things is happening out here, man. Everybody be careful. New York, anywhere there's a crowd or something like that. And people think, oh, I'm going to the good area yeah. and it's going to be nothing. No, 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 no. That's no. the area that's where they That's where they come it. in. That's right? where they come in. Why would they go somewhere where it's nothing like the hood Look, and shit like that? I'm holding my bag on me right now. I don't trust these That's why I ain't bring mine. <laughs> that's, I can't. You got to grab my back, bitch. That's the only motherfucking yeah, way you take up. my... Like, that's crazy to me. Nah, that's, they they, they out here cold. thieving. That's it's what I'm saying. It's not even the holidays. It don't need to be. The thing is, right after the holidays is where everybody really need the money. That's true. You know what I'm saying? Because Shit they done spent up. it all. It's fucked up for the last, next, especially right after Thanksgiving. I say you're going to start getting money mid-March. You That's a get, fact. Your That's money going to start coming back up. Coming back you know what I'm saying? Better. But other than that, from November to February, you ain't got no bread like that unless you got bread like that. And people don't get that. And they'll really ask you for money. Like, I, like I'm like i fucked up, too. I had a holiday. <laughs> holiday <laughs> kids. Family. I had you know kids to buy shit for. Oh, fuck. I'm broke, too. We broke together. You why you coming to, why you coming to me? Do people ask you to borrow money? Every single second. I bet you if I look at my phone right now, <laughs> somebody's trying to get some bread because they need their electricity. The first of the money's coming up or just left or they late on their shit and they like, you know what? You're the last person I can ask because everybody else saying they Are broke. Are you because really of the, the last person? I'm the first, middle, and last. It okay. all depends on who it is. You see what I'm saying? So I all the things that I got going on, people don't understand. It's like, yo, I got a lot of shit going on. Yeah, see me got a lot of shit going on. I'm spending a lot of bread. 
Why would you ask me for the money, though? Yeah, so I be having that. Because when I think about any time I really ever needed something, and my like my mother has always been like, because I always think like your parents your are, are going to be. So I, when I left out of college and mm-hmm. I was like in between, I like went back home. You always, I feel like everybody goes back home at Gotta a go point. Home. Gotta go at home. a point, even if it's like for a month or two, mm-hmm. like you go back home, recoup. And then you, you know, you got to have a launching pad to to leave from. But after that, like, that's just it. That's it. Like, you just got to fucking run. You got a six-month window and that's it. it. But I don't understand how people will allow themselves not to push out of that. It's comfort. You know what I'm saying? You can't, and even when people come try to stay at my crib and shit like that, I'm going to get them the fucked up room with the bed that's not comfortable. (laughs) No, I don't let people stay at my home. (laughs) I have an issue with that. I hear you. But because you, comfortability in my own home, I have to have. Yes. I'm not like one of those people that are like, oh, everybody come stay at my house. No, not me neither. I not hate neither. those I, people. And I can't say the people. You <laughs> like, know what I really hate that? the most is I, I, of course, in any crib I go to, of course, I'm have multiple bathrooms. Yes. If you go to my actual bathroom. That's mad weird. That's disrespectful. Don't go to, I don't even like for you to walk in my room. What, what are you doing in here? Unless my, we fucking, you should not be in my room. Yeah, still use the other bathroom. Why, Some people. Why in your room, though? People disrespectful. That's, that's what I'm what saying. I'm so, it it's is disrespectful. disrespectful. It's disrespectful motherfuckers. Unless you welcome them in, like, my closet, like, any of that. I don't like people. Yeah, when you're vibrating, like you probably got your sleep. vibrator to the side. You nah, probably I don't like got vibrators. one and just throw it out to the side and just went to sleep. You know what I'm saying? Or that's condos. You. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> <laughs> you reading your life talking about acting like it's me. Yo, my, it looks so it's crazy, right? My mom... Came to my crib to uh to cl- do my crib. I mean, clean it up clean, or whatever. Yeah, mama's. Yeah. thank you, mama. Washing my clothes. We praise the Lord mama. for mama. She cook food. She and I'm down the street. I'm going down the street. I left her. She want me to go get some pine saw shit from the store, the dollar store. Meaning so that down, you have no cleaning products. Of course not. Disgusting. It's me. It's straight nigga. You know what I'm saying? That's so, nasty. I'm, I'm I'm barely there. Like I promise, you, I'm never at the You're crib. You're never heard to come in there and be like, I'm not stepping a toe in this bitch. No, no. To the crazy part, all. I'm not even dirty because it's, it's, I'm never there. So nothing is really out of place. She just, as a mom, everything's dirty. You see what I'm saying? So she, when she went, no there, dirty, I'm yeah. driving, and I just hurt and turned around because you know my whole crib is dirty. If you go in my drawers inside the uh, kitchen, herbs and all that type of shit in there. You go to my room, Lord have mercy. So when I went up in there, I had a bunch of I don't dumb understand shit. what Lord have mercy means. My mama seeing any of that shit is a problem. My mama don't even know I smoke. Oh, you did say that. I don't know. My mama Your mother that. definitely knows you smoke. No, no, she don't know I smoke. She don't know I smoke. I got a funny story about that. We I went to wax his uh, mom's house with him, and we smoked on the way there. Before he went inside, he rubbed his hands on some deodorant in his glove compartment so that she wouldn't smell like it. No, Listen, not any, deodorant. Anything that's around, I don't care if it's a piece of candy. If I would put candy on my hand like this, <laughs> I'm putting candy all over me. I don't care if I put it in my mouth to wet it up just so it can stick on me so my mama don't smell. That's how afraid I am. You can't be fucking serious. What the fuck is that going to do, because you dirty my mama, nigga, you? Niggas are so dirty. Wash your fucking hands. I did wash my hands. No, that's you why you I, had I needed a reason. I needed a reason to go in the bathroom and wash up because if I go by her, I gotta Ma, get her I got to give her a kiss. Ma, I got deodorant on How you doing? Yeah, I'm like, yo, Ma. You, you don't think she smells your, your smoky lips? She said it. She said one time, she like, you got this little stench on you. I'm like, yo, Uncle and was smoking. I always blame it on my Uncle now. I, Nigga, your lips always is black as they your are? face. Yes. <laughs> 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 now you start licking them. <laughs> It shouldn't be. <laughs> that's not going to help. But if my mom ever catch me smoking, I'm going to stop smoking. So that's why I she try my best. No way. Sure. No way. For fucking sure. Mom, anyway. Don't listen to this, mama. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we going to give out some advice. You know how it goes. Yes. Hit us up in the DM. And y'all definitely been DMing us. Yeah, we like that. Jump in the DMs, baby. At Bully and the Beast <laughs> yeah, Podcast. What? At Bully and the Beast podcast, holler at us, man. He Jump just in them said shit. Like, yeah, we just love it in the deal, I thought you was going to throw it another alley you. You know what I'm saying? No, fuck, I got to do that for. You should know what to say. It's yeah. time, Let's okay? It. It's time. Mm-hmm. Now, if you need any advice, you can slide up in them DMs, and yes. um, you know we always gonna give you the good advice, hood advice, Amazing and all advice. that good stuff. All that drunk shit, yeah, high shit. But well, that's him. He's clearly drunk. So, did I tell you I saw your boo? Who? Jason. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, sweat. You see a sweat come down. Excuse me? Who are you Why talking to? Why did both of y'all get so 
scared, you dirty ass motherfuckers. I hate guys. Stop Y'all it. like <laughs> you. Everybody heart stop. Yeah, because I, I, I think I'm single, but you know what I mean. Are I, you? Yeah, I, I think I'm single. You're not single. Squirt. No, he, he's not single. I'm. I'm. I'm like. Oops, I'm, I'm in like a twenty percent relationship. You know what I'm saying? That's it. And so you're giving twenty percent, and she's giving eighty. No, I don't even think she give anything. I'm just in a situation to where there's nothing I can really do at the end of the day because I have to be there. I mean, I got to be in her life, so, you know. You I have do. to be in this person's life that you're dating? I'm not even dating. It's just it's just something that we have to do. It's just a life that you have to live. You know what I'm saying? And who's that? <laughs> what do you mean a life you have to live? I'm so it, lost. It's just, and, and everything is always a relationship and everything. Yeah, we, we all like work relationships. We got, you know. No. Loving relationships. We got all different relationships. And I want to make that clear, like, for some of the people that watch that are not really familiar with the Bully and the Beast podcast, because mm-hmm. you just started midway through or, like, on the last episode. But, like, I fucking hate wax. That's cool. And this is something that everybody knows. They know why. Go do your research and, yes. and you'll see why. We are, this is, like, my most disgusting brother, but I would never claim him as a brother because yes. I wouldn't want anybody to think I really know him. So it's that kind way. of situation. I call you the evil sister, like the evil sister with the. I don't think I don't have is the uh, the slipper. You know what I'm saying? What's that show? First of all, it's the stepsisters. Yeah. <laughs> like, I don't think I don't have is the fucking slipper, and I'm losing that. Oh night. yeah, because you're definitely Cinderella. <laughs> Cinderella, <laughs> Cinderella for real, because she's definitely the evil mean sister. For Niggerella, no <laughs> I and like I, that better. And I take it, Niggerella. Um, no, <laughs> but I will say, like, um, I'm never going to try to change his mind on anything that he has to say because I don't give a fuck. Bless him. <laughs> like Bless that. him. I appreciate That's that. It. Now, if it was my situation and my relationships, like, mm. if it's my guy. Then yes. I will talk to him in a civilized manner. Wax. You should talk to me like that. Never. Because you why? Because Never. everything you don't know how much you actually helped me out. When L'Oreal talked to me, L'Oreal called me one day. I was on a way on a flight and I'm at the airport. He doesn't listen to and shit. She it's a waste of breath. Fucking tore my ass. Up to, I was thought about that shit for three. I never would tell her, but for three or four days, I'm thinking about L'Oreal yelling at my ass. I'm like the fuck she right, but damn. <laughs> I hate when you write. I ain't gonna lie to you. Yeah, like today? I hate when L'Oreal is okay, right. Okay, so, um, you know, we always transfer on the Bully and Beast podcast, and me and Wax Ash just got into it. Always, but And he's yes. going to think about this for three I fucking am. days. I mean, and if, because I'm tired of y'all reaching out to me, telling me that the episode's not on YouTube. It's not my fault. Me and Twerk are doing all we can. <laughs> <laughs> it is Twerk's fault, too. But if Wax threatened Twerk on a daily basis, I think that we would get the YouTube up a little. Just quicker. tell that's what I'm oh, saying. Just tell me, tell me, tell me my part. Yeah. But no, with that yeah. being said, we might be looking for an intern. Yes. So if you live in the New York area, in the Atlanta area, reach out with your resume, How ciao, Come on. and we uh, may have a job for you. Okay. Anyway, Appreciate let's move that. forward. We're gonna give yes. out some advice. Mm-hmm. Uh, again, where can they reach out on that DM? At Bully and the Beast Podcast. Holla at us. Hey y'all, I'll get straight to it. Mm-hmm. My man is 36. This better not be a motherfucking email we did before I twerk. No. Are you sure? Mm-hmm. You sure? Are you deleting? the old one please delete them okay we all can right, email right. them to ourselves or something but <laughs> yeah i had to because the ages is looking very familiar but a lot of people are 36 okay <laughs> okay hey y'all i'll get straight to it my man is 36 i'm 28 he has kids and it's never bothered me but his baby mama is a different story this bitch is trash she's one of those people who puts on the front for social media like she's this great person, but then she sends her kids over with no clothes, hair all over their head. I could go on and on. I've embraced everything since the beginning. I have zero problems with their ba- with doing their hair, but their mom actually does hair for a living. Mm-hmm. Me and him have been together three years. She hasn't brought a single Christmas gift for them at all. This bitch is trifling. We obviously do not like each other. We established that early on so she holds her tongue and she keeps her distance because she knows I'll fuck her ass up. Mm. Anyway, well, I like this one. 
Anyways, once in a while, I'll go to her page and see if she's talking shit or being a whore. (laughs) (laughs) I'm the type of person I give everyone the benefit of the doubt. So when she tried to come for me years ago, when me and him was a few months in, I took it personal. And it's been up ever since. Plus, she moves sloppy as fuck. She been caught in so many lies. So that's my way of knowing what the fuck is really going on. The other day, she was on FaceTime with one of her daughters. And she started crying because she missed him. The other day, he... Oh, the other day, he was on FaceTime with one of his his daughters. daughters, And she started crying because she missed him. She said she's never... He said she's never done that before. Sorry, Mm -hmm. Mm y'all. So we both started thinking maybe something triggered her. They came over the same weekend, and they were abnormally quiet. And let him tell it, his baby mother energy has been super weird. Now, last time, she was acting like she put the nigga on child support. Instead of just talking, she does sneaky shit, and that's why I can't respect her. So today I went to her page, and basically in the bio, it says she's moving to another state. Mind you, we ain't heard shit about this. And like I said, the bitch is sneaky and trash. I feel like she's about to bounce and told the kids not to say anything. My man loves the fuck out of his kids and goes above and beyond to make sure that his kids are straight. She always has this weird vibe like she jealous. I'm very intuitive, and I picked up on that early. I say that to say she would do some shit like move to another state to take the kids <clears throat> with no regard for how he feels about it. Now, I'm not. a smart bitch. She could have put that in her bio as bait to see if it would come back around or is she really dumb as I think she is. Oh, shit. Here's our guest. First off, we have a guest. <laughs> and I know when you just seen us two seconds ago, there was no guest, right? Gosh. And we also were in the middle of a DM giving uh, somebody some advice. But we got Rocky Thunder in the motherfucking yeah. building. This well, is my girl. What? What happened? I transitioned to Rocky for real. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, you oh, excuse me. <laughs> no, you wax. You didn't even real. know who Rocky was at all. I did because she had, she got shades on now. Before I'm not used to having the shades well, on. Well, she remembered you quite well. She called me an asshole. I did. But I, I did. did. But she always, oh, no, listen, only assholes become preachers. No, she that. never said that. He I, I, I didn't, yeah. but we're going to rock with it. But let, me, <laughs> but let me not fuck up your intro. Give it up. <laughs> no, so let's give it up for Rocky for real. Thank you. For okay. real, for real. So where, why did you transition? Um, one, I just wanted to leave that name in the past. I had some 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 smut attached to it, some yeah. bullshit. <laughs> it's my, it's <laughs> and, and I just wanted to really bring myself back out to the forefront of the public for real. Like, yeah. So it's Rocky for real, like for real, for real. I like to so say you're going to be for real about everything today. You're going to for real give some good advice Forever. to the people. And we don't feel like reading the whole rest of the letter again. So we're going to just brief it up. For okay. You, right. Okay. Yes. And we're going to let you hear the end because we don't know what happened at the end. Okay. Yeah. So basically our homegirl wrote in. Right. Mm-hmm. All she did was reach out to our DMs at. Bully and the Beast podcast. Holla at us. Finally, you're on point. I got like, I'm back. almost shocked. I'm got your back. Rocky's I'm almost here. shocked. He, he, he's if, on his Rocky, name right now. If Rocky wasn't for real here, <laughs> you get what i She's for real here. She's then really here. Maybe you wouldn't have been on point, but you did. Yes. He, first time he's ever like, then maybe like the second. Congratulations. Y'all yeah, clap good it up. job. Give me yeah, one and a half. Not, I'm not joining that applause, <laughs> but I will encourage. She wouldn't. I encouraged I'm it. Proud of you. Bless us, okay, bless so us. in a brief summary, our homegirl, she reached out mm-hmm. and she said that she is with this guy. 36. Right? 30, she she's, already fucked she's up. She's 36. <laughs> That's okay. how she messed up right there. Okay, she he's 36. He's 36. So you mm-hmm. fucked up. Two wax. No, that's what And I said. she's 28. He has mm-hmm. kids. Mm-hmm. The baby mom is a fucking trash bag. Mm-hmm. She doesn't buy the kids no gifts. So she say. She puts everything off on, on him to mm-hmm. do everything. She does spiteful shit. Whatever. She just wants to get along and be cool. And sh- the, the baby mom ain't shit. Right? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So now the kids started acting funny. 
And the other day, the daughter was crying because she said she missed the father. So they're like, this is abnormal behavior. Right. Come on over. Let's see what's happening. She looked in the woman's uh, page because she'd be looking sometimes to mm-hmm. see if she's either a whore. Wrong. Or, or what was the other thing she said? A so whore. this is the stepmama. So kind of, yeah. They, okay. She's yeah, in yeah, a relationship yeah. with okay. She's the girlfriend. She wants to see if she's messy or she's a whore. Yeah, a messy or messy whore, which yes. is both the same thing. She's trying to see if the mama's a messy whore? Yeah, she be okay. checking the okay. shit. Okay. She Stay be checking the, the shit. Okay. Okay. Now, I mean, it, that's kind of normal, yeah. right? Kind of. Kind of, kind of normal. Kind of maybe Y'all tell them on yourself. Yeah. No, because it's a natural thing. People look at stuff. It's curiosity. It's and a curiosity. Know, and you know, you can't always believe what your mate is telling you all the time. Yeah. So and I don't, that doesn't mean, weave. but that also doesn't mean look every day. No, definitely don't. That obsession is is for the birds. That yeah. should drive you yeah. crazy. But, but to yeah, look. Because you're, wrong. yeah, every now and then a little peek like, oh, I'm, I'm still better than this bitch. <laughs> you know that's how you feel like. I, I but if, you know you. what's crazy a lot of the times like if you find out that you're that much better than her that mean that I mean that you that much better than her that mean he he left trash so that mean he just got somebody just around the same thing as you if you if you leave a girl that she's really dope mm-hmm. and then you go to you now you're supposed to feel like oh you know what you know and I'm saying I'm better than somebody that's dope but if you left if he left some trash right what's that really saying about you at the end of the day well maybe he woke up. This could be somebody that he was with for quite some time. Mm-hmm. Sometimes that's like a high school sweetheart. Sometimes okay. that's mm-hmm. somebody that you wasn't fully developed with who you even knew you wanted to be with at the time. Because right. when I was in my 20s, it's not what I needed for today. No. You know, think no. about it. That's a total different person. So they have yes. kids together. They were together. That's three kids I counted. Uh, so that seems like quite some time. That's a family. You, that's a For family. Sure. And and that might have been somebody you just got stuck fucking loving and that bitch turned up to be a bum. When right. I met you, bitch, you was running track. You went to school. <laughs> right. You got and, comfortable. And you had a job. And now, mm-hmm. bitch, you had kids and now you're a trash bag that just wants people to take care of them. That happens. You it know. Happens. So awesome. I don't want to completely blame him because it could have been the bitch that just fell the fuck off. Okay. So mm. or she, got comfortable. She could be a piece of shit too, but like to go from a piece of shit to a piece of shit is a little crazy. You got to upgrade part, your next and relationship. Sometimes a man can help push you to being a piece of shit. Not saying that being a piece of shit to your kids because that's never no, that's trash. That. Yes. yes, but sometimes a nigga could mentally fuck the shit out of you, and then all of a sudden now you don't know how to function out here. You looking true. crazy? I, I, got a gut out that. there. It happens all the but time. But it's the kids, like you said, it's, it's the, the kids kid. that you don't buy them Christmas gifts. You send them. Oh. Uh This is one part I didn't like. She's a hairstylist, the mom. And she be sending the kids with their hair not done, their clothes all raggedy. raggedy. Like, that's corny. That's Mm -hmm. who does that to their kids. Meanwhile, she on Instagram looking like... Looking fly. The number one stunner. Wah, 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 wah. She got to. (laughs) Because it ain't about her no more. It's it's about the other relationship. I know there are some women that like to get payback and they're like, while my kids are with me, I'm going to keep them like this. But when the daddy like comes, you're going to go outside in the ones that you figure it out. Not yep. the hair it's, looking it's crazy. It's foul. It's foul. Everything. You're going to make you spend all your money Everything. on that. She's doing their hair. I'd rather do my own kids' hair. 100%. Like, that's a little crazy. So, all right, we're going to see where the wrap-up was. So, she said um, she looked into her bio. Mm-hmm. And in the bio, she like, yeah, about to move out of state. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> so this is what she saw on social media. We know, we know what right. that's about. So this is yeah. what she said. She was like, instead of just talking, you know, she does this sneaky stuff. Is this? No, 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 no. We've been had that. Okay, da, 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 sorry. Picked up on that early. Da, 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 da. I'm a smart bitch. So she she put it in her bio. All, okay. by, uh, all that. I'm a smart bitch. She could have put that in her bio as bait to see if it would come back around. Right, right. Or right. she really just dumb as hell as I think she is. Either way, do I tell my man? I've stayed all the way in my lane for three years Mm -hmm. for the sake of the kids. Stay there. But this bitch is about to break my nigga's heart if she moves for real. So should I say something? Is it even my place? I hate sitting on this information because I feel like I'm holding the secret too. You wasn't supposed to have that information. Exactly. I don't want her to be blindsided, (laughs) but I know if I say something, it can open a huge can of worms. I don't know what to do. Please help. And y'all got to remember this. If she does just up and move out of state, which is illegal, by the way, and I don't know what state y'all live in, but he could fight that and get the kids and get custody of the kids. You can't just do that. That's kidnapping. Mm -hmm. Um, But if... She doesn't say nothing, and the, the lady does it sneakily. Mm-hmm. Maybe she, he don't have a chance to even try to stop her from what she's doing, even yeah. though she's not supposed to be looking at that page. Yes. I would make a fake account. 
and DM him and send him screenshots yeah, of the bio yeah, like yeah. because why doesn't he Act know like you a dude. he doesn't he don't follow guy. her child you got the I mean I'm just assuming he don't follow her he got if he, you follow her. he he also he looking to he know what's going he on he looking to she might I unfollow not, somebody when I stop fucking with them yeah but you got kids you got yeah, kids but, but the they kids might is have different. been stopped unfollowing each other though you never know you get what I'm saying like who knows cause I know some people mm-hmm. that are in a relationship that don't follow each other. That's like a rule of theirs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I don't follow mine. You're right. You I don't even follow my kid. Me and my kid don't you follow each other. You see what I mean? Yeah, it's for p- yeah. protection. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Yeah, Stay out like, the way. Mm-hmm. So he might not follow her. Okay, well, that's his bad. <laughs> <laughs> because you got, you got an old raggedy ass bitch for a baby mama. Yeah, I would be watching you, you her watch every fucking everything, move. Yeah, right? but you, yeah. you understand. You got to be active. I, I know that he's... he's uh, I don't think she's going to lose. I think that is like kind of some bait to try to get them to come together. Because earlier in the in the text, you was like, um, the girl was crying like she missed him or whatever the case may be. So it was she like, missed the dad. Yeah. Oh, the baby. The baby, the baby. cried. Uh, was called him on Facetime and said, "I miss you." And she was like, "Why are the kids acting like this?" Mm. So the kids, to her, she's saying the kids know that they're not going to be around their dad for much longer. Did she attempt mm. a relationship with the baby mom? Um. She did. She said from the beginning she, she was just she trash was, to her. Yeah, she knew what she was. But how about this? So if you feel like the kids might know what's going on, right? Mm-hmm. Why don't you try to get information get out, the kid. out the kids? One little trip kids to McDonald's, you're going to know everything. <laughs> kids tell Let me get the I'm ice, get the you. icy, crushed ice. Is that fucked up, though? Nah, nah, you gotta do what you, as a parent. Is there's no limits? There's no limits to what you gotta do to know what's going and on. Yeah, with every little and, bit and she want to protect her man at the end of the day too. So I think that is cool. Yeah. Press the kids. Press I don't, them. I don't, I don't think press Panini them. Panini press. But yeah, <laughs> it, it's, it's it's little tactics that you do with kids, and they just gonna blur it out anyway. Yeah, it's not much. You okay, to do. ain't much you gotta idea. do. I got an idea. Get in the car. Give me a little play. melatonin. Move, bitch. Get, get out, out the way. way. Yeah. Get out the way, bitch. Hey. Get out the way. So you start dancing and shit. You can't everybody let me like, did y'all ever move? <laughs> Are y'all going to move? <laughs> you ever thought about moving? You ever thought about moving? You should move right now. Let me see you move. Like, like, we are moving. How would you feel if me and daddy moved? Right. Well, me and mommy moving. Take oh, what the fuck are y'all, huh? You yeah, little... mommy just told us not to tell daddy. <laughs> you see? It gotta be something. She'll be real shocked. They be like, yeah, my yeah. daddy, my mommy said they gonna move in together. together. Ooh! Because they you know they said not coming? You! <laughs> and be like that That might sometimes. be what it is, too. Wait, 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 too. sorry. She's the fan. She's the fan. Hey, fan. We, we just, appreciate we you. We joking. He it not leaving happens. you. He it not happens, leaving you. Though. He, might, he might be leaving you, but the not other... Not for the, trash. Yeah. Not for somebody who don't do their kids here. Let me tell you. I've, be doing I've, it. I've seen men leave for the most riggedy, raggedy ends. Straight up, me oh, too. Don't matter. And I did too. I did what too. is it though? Um, I don't even know. I, I guess I, I left one girl because she was too good for me, and I hated to treat mm. her bad. Niggas you know what I'm saying? Like so I, ru- mm-hmm. I rather treat the trash bad. You know what I'm saying? It's I'll, easy I'll, work. Yeah. If, if I got a clean exactly. place, mm-hmm. if I got a clean place, and I'm about to do some dirt, I'm go to the dirtiest place. If I, if I know that I, I'm all cleaned up and I want to do the right thing, I'm going to go to the clean place because I know I can handle that and do it the right way. I ain't going to smoke inside a big mansion where everything is white. I'm going to go down, downstairs to the, to the basement <laughs> yeah. and go do my that's thing. A fact, you see what I'm that's saying? That's fucked up, though. So it's, what about the, how, like, you don't care what you're doing to that person? You do. That's why you got to leave and let her try to grow in hills as soon as, as soon as possible. No, but you're, you're saying you're going for another type of woman in your mind, but that's still a, a human being with feelings. Yeah, she 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 knows she trash. But she, she's she getting on that. what she's used to too. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody got an antenna that could get certain frequencies. That's fucked you know up, I mean? like, man. It's like having it's, it's like shit. having the TV. You ain't got no cable. You gonna get the first ten <laughs> channels. That you're you gonna, gonna enjoy that. That's all you are right. That's as HD. I'm gonna give you them ten channels mm, in HD. And, and you know what you're dealing with because you've been with her for how many years with three kids? You know exactly what you're getting right. I can't fuck with nobody that have my kids looking crazy. I can't fuck with a bitch that don't fuck with her kids. I don't like I sure not. like yeah. and I was cool, semi cool through other people like whatever. I'm not diving too deep into it because I don't like to talk about people's kids. Yeah, right? yeah, 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 yeah. But she didn't take care of her kids, and I never felt comfortable with being cool with her. Yeah, you can't because shit. If they do their kids like that, what they gonna do to yeah, you? Yeah, so I speak mm-hmm. to her 
or whatever, but I look at her like a piece of trash. Yes. And I never said that 100%. to her. But that's why I don't have no Let's respect Let's call her up. Call her. No, because it's like, yeah. no, she know. Because it's yeah, like yeah. when I'm talking to you, I don't have no respect for you. And that's right. it's a reason. Right. Sometimes, like, I treat people like that on purpose because I, like, I think they're trash people. Right. So, like... If I feel like that's the energy you're putting out, I'm not about to give you great energy. No. I could be cordial and cool and you won't never, you know, know in yeah, a conversation yeah, yeah. to others. Right. But deep down, you could tell I don't fuck with don't you. Fuck with you. Mm-hmm. And it's because you're a bum ass bitch that don't take care of your child. Mm. And like, I couldn't just, I could see if it was a reason as far as right. like mental, maybe yeah. that they're not stable enough and maybe something changed. Because people go through postpartum and shit and sometimes they don't never come back. Right. You know what right. I mean? Yeah, Some people gone, mind me real fucked up. Yeah. You know, shut up, Wax, yeah, because I'm talking real. about stop. I'm just keeping it real. Postpartum. You being funny, though. Yeah, no. Them motherfuckers got to have postpartum. I'm going to call it that or just a straight mental problem. I mean, everybody right now, they always talk about mental health and stuff. That's I think, Is mental health new? Nah, nah, this is just, new for black people because we allowed we're to allowed say to it now. We allowed to talk about it now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we all before we were just time. niggas. Yeah, we straight up. We yeah. straight up. They got nigga crazy. That? that nigga went nigga. You know who that nigga is? <laughs> <laughs> they got the devil in you. Yeah. Of course that nigga was gonna <laughs> yeah. do that shit. Like, like Omar was getting caught, oh, chased by the cops again today. Like that's what he do. Some nigga shit. Right. Yeah, like that's that's shit. That's. You know, it wasn't like we've been had like, bipolar and fucked up back in the hood. We just thought that's, that's uh, how he yeah. react. You know what I'm but saying? But if you go into the club and shit, and, and you mentally you good, bitch, and you not taking care of a uh, little poppy, right? Right. That's yeah, it's a problem. Yeah, yeah it's you. A so problem. I can't see him being like, "Let me go chase my bum ass baby mama, and we gonna dip." I, I don't think that's hopefully, the case. Hopefully not. Nah. But you got to get it out them kids. The kids, t- like we said, kids tell everything. Everything. I didn't. I never met a kid that didn't talk. Too fucking much. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you, a little McDonald's, a little melatonin, <laughs> get them real woozy. Whoa, 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 whoa. What if they don't like her? What's melatonin? You think the stuff you put the kids to sleep? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right when they get a little dready and they start doing like this a little bit and they start talking. You like, going to jail? That's what I'm telling you. You going to jail? Little, I mean, you get, you get. It's a natural supplement. Yeah, but it gotta be a crime to give too much or something. You said they go like this. <laughs> you said they go like this. That's giving well, you blue weed yes. in their face. And, and, you, and you alter them. You, you said <laughs> McDonald's too? I that got to be contact. Ain't nobody just going there. No more. I take nope. one melatonin. I'm gone for three days. Yeah. yeah. yeah so yeah, why? Yeah. So I'm you gonna give it to a kid if you gonna give it? <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. She like I just you, need snap them. A, you need to stimulate a little conversation every night. It's, it's horrible. It's good. It's okay. Good. All right. right. So um, hopefully that helps her. If the kids don't say anything, does she admit that she went on the social media page? I would just lay I would low never for that. say. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. I would, I would nah. lay. Stay out the way. You should be staying out the way anyway. Stop looking at. The other girl's page, like they're gonna antagonize you. No, no, really no, know that you yeah, better. Yeah. Know that you're a better choice. No, he picked you and just stay out the other girl way at all. You don't don't bring nothing into it because I had a situation to where a girl was always looking at the other girl and just try to you know make herself like that because I guess she thought that's what I wanted. Yeah, yeah. And she was just turning me off the whole time, not even. Uh, or it'd be the opposite that you're watching them so much that you get turned off by your dude. Like he was really with that. Like you that, start looking exactly. at them like they. They dirty and a little funky. Oh, and okay. it's well, all okay, of that is that. bad. Because when you're looking, you're comparing, you're you're like, well, why are you doing this with this person? It's like if you know this person exists and they're dealing with your person, right. mm-hmm. you that makes you look even more stupid that you're right. watching the fucking page. First of all, <laughs> let me tell you something. I have so many yes, views on my story that I don't give a fuck who's watching my stories, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's the funny thing because it be bitches that dad be faithfully looking at my shit. You know who you are. Ooh. And mm. I don't even know until somebody tells me. And yeah, I'm like, yeah, this bitch shit. is watching. I don't even have time. Like, yeah, yeah. Give it up. <laughs> I was just, yo, give it bitch, up. bitch, I was chilling. Right. Yeah, now yeah, yeah. it's up. It's up, like, and it's up in a way where, bitch, you never go. Now that I know you're watching, bitch. Right. Yeah, Let's yeah. It's all. <laughs> you know, you know, no, yo, only, only do it. Make, make her, make her our only friend. Like what's that? No, the this close is friends? Not a friend. This is never a friend. No, I'm just saying. No, that's what I'm saying. Friend. Make what her, make her a close friend, what's and only bestie? have her, what's and only have her there. Seriously. Nah, because they're not gonna look from their own page. Think about it. They're looking from a fake page, but you know Please. that they're constantly looking. Yes. You think that she's looking from fucking Tamara or whatever her name yeah. is? She's not. <laughs> I Lisa. saw a few gully bitches that do that. No, thing. some do, and they're like, yeah. "What the fuck are you gonna do if you see right. me looking I'm at that?" But I don't think that's. It's not the point of being gangster. You want to just see what's going on so mm-hmm. you know 
they're not trying to be found out, these girls. You right. get what I'm saying? Because yes. if that's the case, yes. you would write something. You would whatever. Like these, mm-hmm. like even when like I'm talking it. about the bitches, I'm talking about they're watching because they're mad. Like you're watching because you're upset. So you can't let me know you watching. Now, who, who you got mad? Who you got mad now? Bitches be mad every day. Who you got mad? Mad. Because they stay mad. Be... They stay mad. And it'd be funny because they either be like a nigga that's your nigga or right. a nigga you, you don't and with. never would ever touch. And you right, like, you right, love me like, about a nigga that... Enough- like, I love those. Those are my favorite It's the ones. funniest shit. It's the ones that is a cat that I would never deal with. Well, I give him hell. I give him pure hell. And you, the funnier thing is he don't even want the bitch. And she going mad hard looking at your shit. And y'all right. laughing like, yo, you like this bitch or what? Because right. I get... Like can, you, my homeboy, yeah. Like, like man shit. I thought you said this bitch. Like, nah, it's, it's just crazy how women think. And they be thinking you know. Too at the right. same time, it's mm. like, bitch, I didn't even know you. That's why they act a certain no, way when you can. get around. Like, I, I didn't don't even care. know of you. I don't know. Like, I didn't. I'm you don't telling exist. you, I, this shit happened literally just the other day when a nigga told me, I'm like, for real, like, bitch, been watching my shit for like a year and a half. Yeah, like, yeah, I'm yeah. like, should you probably that's got all... scary? Yeah, it is. That's, that's scary. Every they, day, they, they faithfully, somebody something. watching your shit probably numerous times a day. Yeah. Think about it. These bitches be obsessed. Like, yeah, that's weird. But that's why I said in her story, I'm like. I ain't got cap. That's a little weird that you be looking at this bitch's page. Right, yeah. Yeah. Because why? But it happens, though. It happens. Yeah, definitely. Here happens. and there, I guess. Curiosity is a... a it's going to kill that cat. It's yeah. going to that mean dry your pussy up. So you look <laughs> as a man? Yeah. Hell no. I don't give a fuck. You see? I mean, but I mean... Yeah, what, 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 whoa, 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 do like they, uh, no, look, look, look at my look at my ex shorty or the nigga. I don't give a fuck about it. I would never See, look at a nigga. I think that they will look at the ex. I, 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 I look at I look, I look at my ex, I look at my ex shorty shit here and there, but. Nah, all my exes be, oh, I, they sure, all yeah, blocked and sure. all them niggas be. Nah, <laughs> I, 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 I damn yeah, sure, I damn sure would never go out my way to if, if I'm blocked or anything like that. I'm never gonna go out my way. To do it because it's a cat. A majority, a bitch, a majority, on my, on my life. That's cat. On my life. Yeah, you on don't my have a life. Page wax. I'll show you all my shit right now. Hell of no. course, you come on. Yeah, now. You ain't got all shit the shit geared out. <laughs> exactly. No, I, I don't even know how to do all that type of shit anyway. I would never even do that shit. That's that why shit you whack as hell. You stay God blessings. Yeah. See, I, I believe that he wouldn't go on the niggas page. Yeah. No way. Nah, but you've been on a ni- nigga. Don't, don't do it. Don't do it. Oh my word! I ain't been on no nigga don't page. Don't do it. I mean, if I if I got if I got uh, put to the nigga it. page for whatever uh-huh. reason, maybe. But I, there's no way I went to look oh, for oh, a dude. Oh, now you got put to the nigga page because if somebody DM and put it together, somebody Instagram suggested somebody sent no, me this. Oh yeah, exactly. Is somebody that, DM and screenshot me. That's this. what you. That's the lie you use. Somebody no, said no, 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 no. That's no. what she gotta say. Somebody <laughs> sent me your baby mama talk about she was gonna move. Nah, I, w- I wouldn't do that. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm keeping it one mil. You know I ain't gonna lie at all. You know You've what I'm saying? You've looked at a, bo- a man's page before. Not ever in my life. Wow. I never went. To, I never went to a dude page to look at his page to see what's to going see, on. Yes, you have, nigga. That's she know you. That's good. <laughs> I'm putting that on everything. My situation that I had, somebody sent me something to go put Did my put my product. Look I look. I looked at the page oh, and make hey! it. But but no, no, no. Be, no, no. I'm I'm in this situation right here. Mm-hmm. This girl be going to this girl page is checking to see what she got going but on no. her bio. We're you, just saying, you have never. you ever? We're not you comparing you I, to the I, woman. I, I went. Okay. I I got. I got. <laughs> yes, nigga. It's it's okay. Okay. I, it's okay. I got put to the somebody page. I never looked at nobody <laughs> page. Put. You know I what I'm saying? Too. He was placed on someone's I'd be like, find that bitch. Right. Nah, <laughs> my nah, nah, nah. My friend be like... Nah, 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 nah. I wouldn't do yeah, that. Yeah, you can find anything. Because, because at the end of the day, I, 24 hours of the day, I want to be happy all throughout my 24 hours and I want my mate Except or anybody else. Except when you clicked else. on that fucking link. You had a moment. That came to Shit your phone. Happens, nah, yeah, and I'll keep it one million. Nah, I, I did never. It. I don't want to ever feel... I don't want to feel no other type of way. So I, I don't even put myself in no position to even try to get hurt. You see mm-hmm. what I'm saying? I'm not going to just put my hand on the stove for no reason because today at 3 o'clock, I'm going to put my hand on the stove because I want my hand to burn. <laughs> so you feel you like that's what, what women do when they we do look at... all look, the time. That's they, not what we're doing. We want to make sure that you're being honest, not that we want to be hurt. The right. fuck? And, then, and then when you get to the, the point honesty where you... honesty is how actually, he treats you. Fuck the words. Well, honesty that's, that's is how he thing. treats if you. If you're in a good space, it I don't want to know shit. I don't give a damn if your phone rings at 3 o'clock. I'm going to be like this... On this side, that's how I am too. I don't want to hear shit. Thank you. Do not check a text in front of me because I'll be like this over here, like, man, you in my face with it because I don't want to know shit. Thank you. If it's good, you don't want. Why fuck up? See, but it's funny because I'll say something about a text. Like you said, if I see, I'll say something about a text. 
And then my nigga would be like, no, because it's a look. I'll be like, don't. Uh, 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 eyes don't work. Listen, even if you want to show me a picture on your phone, I don't want to see that. Send me the picture. I don't want you to fuck around and, and, and That's smoke. That's kind of sneaky, y'all. Yeah. Because the only reason why y'all doing that because y'all don't want him to look through your shit. No, it's no, not. No, it's because I'm not fucking up a good deal. I did, yeah. It I love a, that. A, you know what I'm saying? That's great. Yeah. I'm telling you, nigga, whoever, because I had an issue where I had to be like, oh, nigga, it's all fun and games over there with this motherfucker that you chatting with. Right. But with me, you got your little, and he like, nah, nah, that's it, because it's my, nah, 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 I'm telling you, if you laughing over there, nigga, keep no. the same energy over We're here. We laughing, laughing too. We, we laughing all, too. We all laughing. We laughing together. Nigga, you got an attitude. You we got an attitude together. over here. We but you laughing together. over there. Oh, no, we all got laugh. But, but if you treating me great, <laughs> if you treating me you great and we got a good him. thing, there's no way I'm going to sit there and try to hurt myself or put myself in a bad nah, situation. Damn, damn. I'm not doing that. that. Yeah, uh-huh. Especially as a man, I'm no, I got I got too much. I got the world to worry about. That's way harder than whatever you're gonna show me. Right. Anyway. So he's a distraction. Even like when you've been hurt enough and like you know your limitations, you know how crazy and wild you could get, like you gotta learn to put a little cap on your cap Please on your do. own ass because I'm like, I don't wanna go there because I don't know if once I go there, if I'm ever coming back again, because this might there be the you final go. straw. There, that's and I start yeah, like really? I, I seen yeah, something no, no, that no, fucked me up. Peace. I never came back from that shit. What about the truth? Y'all don't give a fuck about it. Don't that. matter. The truth, the truth, the truth, the truth, the truth, truth to me is, is how I feel when I'm with you. That's yep. that's my that's only it. truth. That is my really? only so truth. Really? So if they have a whole family behind your back, that's just what she they don't got. Exist if, if they if we they if the they over to, to hide oh, that see, shit I'm and hold like that shit down, I, but that, that I'm burning houses down, nigga. After you find out though, that's what I'm saying. After you find out, but if you can hide that shit from me and stay the fuck out the way, I'm not away. You choose to stay. That's on you. You got to choose to be in peace with it. But I'm saying me, I'm that's not a choice. But the is on. I need I need uh-huh. honesty though said, uh-huh. from, the, from the gate. Uh-huh. If you're treating me good, like I'm gonna stay the fuck <laughs> out the way. And then you say the dude was that's, good. That's me. Then you say the dude was a good guy. Who? Which guy are we talking the about? Guy this in, guy yes. here. She said that he was the an incredible father. father. Yes. Mm-hmm. A good. Guy. They've been together three years. Mm-hmm. Okay. Um, she has no issues with him. The issue is clearly because she's trying to protect him. That's how you know she loves him. Mm-hmm. She's even willing to expose herself right. in order to let him know something so he don't get hurt. Yeah, but you said earlier that you wouldn't mess with a guy with a, with a, uh you wouldn't mess with a baby a guy who had a kids. We talking but about these this guys. Woman. I'm no, saying, no, no, I'm, I'm just prefer, saying. Yeah, no, I, no, I but, prefer, and this is why. No, I've had but, issues with baby moms. She, she could get out the way. She don't have to be snooping in her shit or, or finding certain things about this woman. You know what I'm saying? The more nah. she find out about her, the more she's looking at her, is more she's pissing herself and off about this woman. she might be knowing you looking at the shit anyway, so she like, I'm she just going to be booby you. She does now. Come on now. She's attached to these kids too, though. There's no way that you could be with somebody for three years. They come over every other you gotta weekend. You got to give it up to God. You, you doing it yeah. here. Yeah. Yeah. Just real. stay out the way, man, because it's like, you know, and I always say, you will never know how a dude is. I think you should date somebody with kids or anything because it's like, you don't know if he can take care of his kids. So when nah, you see man. this guy taking care of his kids and being a good guy, don't, 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 Yo, let, the be, don't let the first parents, time dummy. don't let the first time be you. What do don't you let mean the by the way that he takes care of you and treats you too? The way that he treats his family, the way he treats his people, you don't got to know because he has a trial and error, baby. And let me tell you like, something. Not the trial and error, I baby. mean, that's what he's I, 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 I know. I know some dudes, I know some dudes who treat me. their family really well and then is pieces of shit to their kids. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, because, I know because, people because that because of the mama. Because of baby mama. Yes. Right, right. Yeah, you see what I'm happens. saying? That That's the only reason why. He treats his family and everything, but he's like, I don't even want to have to deal with that situation Because of the baby mama. Because of the baby mama. So it doesn't matter who the person is. I am I would be the child's mom, so I know how I am. You get what I'm saying? I'm not really worried and concerned about how he treats another woman, another child, because he could treat your child Terrible and the other child amazingly. I've seen that too. I've seen, that I've too. seen men I've seen that be very involved in one child's life and not the other. So. Or be yeah. really good to their stepchildren and not their real and not their, I mean, look not, at Brian McKnight. Look at Steve. I'm not. I don't know what's going on with Steve, Steve Harvey, Harvey, but Harvey, Laurie Harvey getting the, the the platform. Those kids got his last we don't name. Know nothing, about, nothing about the other ones. Nothing. Not them, and not those the his. Damn, I didn't even kids. know he had other kids. Those real are not though. even his kids. Laurie, not his no. kids. No, 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 That's no, what no. we saying. So now you want to tell me that I need to go get me a nigga that has a... That, no, I'm not doing yeah, that. Steve is I, Steve, though. And let me tell you Good something. Up, um. Actually, I left the dude behind the deciding factor being, could I see myself having to coexist with this woman for the rest of my life? And I said, no. absolutely not. I couldn't deal with this bitch for a, a day. Respect. Let alone. So right. I said, 
do I love him more than this? And I'm, I was like, I don't want to know that woman. I don't want that bitch around me. I would never want her around my child. And mm. I, this was years that I was around. I was yeah. like, fuck him and fuck that bitch. I don't like, like baby I, fathers that's either. I'm, I'm right. with you. I don't like baby fathers either because it's like, you still got to talk to a nigga who put his meat in you and know exactly okay. how your pussy look. You know what I'm saying? He's so insecure. I take that. I'm just keeping it one million. He probably he fucked might have, her He better. might have taught her how to Maybe. do what she do to you. Yeah, they got yeah. you. Exactly. That's yeah, so every upset. time she's on the phone with him. You couldn't cheat shit. You fucking lame ass nigga. I got a little nigga. meat. I'm fucked up. You're right. I can't fuck a nothing. I take all that type you of shit. I can't but fuck clearly nothing. he can't because who the I fuck can't. would think about that? I wouldn't even give three it, fucks. It, I hear you, but it's just like, damn, you still got to. Then why y'all care about the, the other woman then? What do you, you mean? I'm saying I don't want the bitch to deal with the bitch at all. Me neither. Like the motherfucking attitudes that you trying to act like you want to throw pussy. Ball game, he's there because I'm also attached to the kid. I, I want I, certain things I got to talk to the kid about and stuff like that. And this nigga also talking to him. Yeah, if but she your first him, he thing was right. that he put his dick in her. That wasn't right. my concern. I yeah, didn't say because he, he ate her pussy. I don't right. give a fuck what they did. I don't like that bitch. I ain't like Period. the bitch with or without the pussy, okay? <laughs> and sometimes it's the energy that the person brings to you. Yes. Because the person I'm talking about had more than one baby mom one Jeez. was real cool yes. the other one I I not, like I would slap her every time I see her every time time. <laughs> you get what I'm saying so, you get what I'm saying that's how it yeah. is so yes. you, it's not that I can't coexist with another woman it's not that like she's fine the, but then I did see one time like even though he didn't, he didn't fuck with her in mad years she had got a little drunk and we was cool, whatever. And it looked like she was like trying to throw the pussy at him. And I'm yeah, like, nah, yeah, the yeah, baby yeah, yeah. mom is just some whores. No, I'm trying to tell you. They always going to sit there and try to go back to the baby fathers. It's so why are you asking a... me why I want somebody with, I'm, even without with kids? Me, even with me. I'm just, even with the woman. It's like he know they still got to communicate. And one day, someday, one day, somebody might slip and fall. It be... I'm not going to lie. If you establish the co-parenting thing, what it should be the fucking problem? Because there's people in my life that, like, I used to, like, say I might have dated them before, right? Mm -hmm. And, like, with me, I don't even look at them like that. But they still be on my head. I'm like, please let it fucking go. Because know how go. I look. No, though. No. <laughs> like, do you get, if I'm saying no, just be cool. Yo, like, I, why see, I, I seen somebody cool? not too long ago, and I just, they just, Popped up on me, and first thing I looked at when I seen him, I remember exactly how her toes look. I know how her pussy yeah, look. Yeah, like how, how the fuck are y'all so perverted? That's and not fucking... perverted. It's just what it is. <laughs> not what... what it is is I'm telling you that we just cool, so you should do that. Yeah, you get what I'm saying? Or cool. don't talk to me. That's an option. No, maybe well. I, maybe I shouldn't talk because I looked at you. I see exactly how your pussy look and your toes look. No, you know not don't say you're there. Right, right, <laughs> there. Right, right, there. For sure, there's for sure. But. So you can't let that go. I'm just a little. I'm sorry. Lost. I'm just keeping it one million. Like when I seen it, I was like, oh shit, her toes are. I mean, pussy. but it all depends on how, how good the ass. foundation of the relationship really was. So, if it, if, and we if not it beefing. All just goes back to no. I'm saying if it just goes back to the toes and and the way the pussy right. look and how you so you ain't really have like that bond that bond because if you had that bond with her, it's like I'm gonna respect your boundaries and shit, and you still gonna be my ace. You need me, I got you, and vice versa. But yes. Yeah, yeah we, we, we still cool and everything, but it's still a sexual thing came in my brain. If she don't let you fuck, are you still going to reach out to her? No, we still cool. At the end of the day, I, I ain't just touched her in years, but it was just like, oh, shit, like, okay. But in my mind, right away, like, something damn, sexual that, that came up. That fat that ass and all that type gushy. of shit came up in my brain. <laughs> and the same thing with a dude see my baby mom and she looking good. I mean, see my shorty and she looking good. That's her, that's her baby father. He's gonna look like that. I remember but fucking that's okay, that. Though. You know that's what I'm saying? All, it's okay. Not it's for like, me. You, but you got that's yours now. Like, yeah, I got that. Right. Got that. That's me right there. Yeah, yeah. So once you, you fuck, I need to grow up. You feel like once you we fuck, you do. can always fuck. Do, uh, do you no. feel like once you fuck somebody, you feel like you can always go back to fucking? No, them? because every every girl who fuck uh, who fuck me like can't it? do that. Every girl, I won't fuck every girl I fuck before. There's no not way. There's on this planet that I can't touch if I want to. Yeah. But I, I just... Every girl can't say that's that That's how I me. feel. I feel like with the guys, they're always available. As I'm me, that's I'm also still not. friends with every single one of my... See, that's cool. Friends. See, not you know everyone I'm not. I'm not cool. Couple. I'm not cool have, at all. Um, with the exception of one, because she got a little volatile. Like, when yeah. you... Like, but Jeez. like if we broke up because you was cheating, or you had another bitch. Like that is that's not a that's not like a super deal breaker. Nah. It's like that you do you doing what niggas do. But and what if okay it's like a repeated offender with well, one, one of your friends or one of your friends and stuff creatures. like that? That's what they do. It's just it's once it's in them, it's in them. I just it's feel no like certain things are unforgivable, and maybe it goes around the way you did it 
or the way you moved when you cheat. I'm not really sure, yes. but right. something. If you cheated with so one of your friends, that, 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 one of your friends or your sister, nah, right? Now that's unforgivable. Yes, that's unforgivable. In your house, for sure. Oh, for sure. I mean, now I'm lighting your mama house on fire. <laughs> See, that's you know, okay. too far. So that happened that's to why, me. That's why I don't yes. look at fire. Disrespect. Already, yeah, disrespect. That happened to me before. Say but you want to hear the fucked up part? Yeah. I didn't catch him. Say what now? I caught on Instagram. The no. bitch was in the, in the bed taking a picture. That ass. Oh, so we you was looking at the picture. You was looking at her Instagram, then. Yeah, I found it. Oh, okay. She wrote a comment I, I'm underneath I'm surprised we're on this part and I'm not sitting behind with a phone like this and we like, on a, went like hey girl, I, know, I, know, I know, So I didn't you. see him for a while. I had fucked everything because we had two cribs, right? Mm. I fucked everything up in the crib. Because when I seen it, I was by myself and he was in the other crib. I was in the, the one crib. Mm. So I'm literally laying in the bed that the bitch is like this in. Praise mm. God for your freedom, first and yeah, foremost. Yeah, you hear that? I would have been behind him. I fucking literally, I busted everything up and I fucking took all my stuff. And I had never done anything to anybody else, only him, like as far as like <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. destroying things. Like I've never before that, never after that, yeah. because I don't believe in that. But you know when somebody just do something to the no, core, you snap. like no, that's to, a snap. I snap. No, that's, that's wild. Snap. Like I snap, but like her I her pussy see, juices. You laying on her pussy juices. No, nah, that's too it much. Was, it was different sheets, though. At least uh, he was uh, that uh, respectful. Okay, but thank I God. Will no, say, that's too much. It, it was that energies much. in that household on that bed. Yeah, I yeah, wanted yeah, to yeah, burn yeah. the house. Down. I did feel course. like I wanted to burn the house down. I bleached. Like I just went crazy. But I will say that it was from a comment that she left underneath. And yeah. I had always kept seeing her write little comments, and I'm like, who the fuck is... But her right. page was private. Yeah. So then uh, one day, I was fucking just there, and something told me, look at this motherfucker. Look at that particular page. I looked, I opened right. it up, and sure fucking... And I never had an inkling about anybody. Yeah, I never yeah. looked at no other bitch's shit. Mm. I looked, and sure enough, I seen the bitches in my crib chilling, mm. bitches in the car, Ooh. bitches in not my car, but one of his. Peace, and I was like, peace. yo, this nigga is disrespectful. So to me, like, something like that is unforgivable. Like, even if I speak yeah, to yeah, you yeah, again, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm never going to fuck with you for real again. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. in my mind, that's done. Like, you're done. You're trash. Like, that's low. Especially when you have bread, you could have moved around yeah. and did anything. Hotel. Yeah, no, Come that's, on. That's there was other bedrooms in the crib. How about I, I, you sleeping in another bed? I ain't never been done like that. Like that, that was that's crazy. A different level. No, that's he was the most level. disrespectful nigga I've ever met in my life. But he also was abusive. All kind of other things. So yeah, that's yeah, a yeah. whole nother situation. Oh, yeah. Well, he could burn in hell. <laughs> <laughs> See, but that's what I'm saying. That's like a person that, like, if I would speak back to you, I still just don't never fuck with you. You yeah, know what I'm trying to yeah. say? Like, I say what up, but I don't fuck yeah, with you. Like yeah, like it's yeah. so that with that person no, but other exes that are just like little shit, it's like not real exes people I used to talk to. Right. Yeah. All them niggas would come back today, tomorrow, yeah. the yeah, next yeah, week. It's on, it's only two girls that I would never fuck again. You know what I'm saying? The Why? rest of them. Uh just this dirty shit. You know what I'm saying? Like Try to get me locked up, call the cops, or oh, just yeah, see what I'm saying? Like, like certain things is like you try to get me jammed up on some dumbass shit that get really get me fucked up or get yeah, me yeah. locked up on these is all false tenses, you know what I'm saying? So I'm not fucking around with them. Other girls who know how to hold their self and their composure and we just ain't fucking with each other right now or whatever the case, oh go your way, go do your way. You but know what, what I'm saying? What was they saying on you to get you locked up? Anything. The girls are saying like, anything. Like, oh, he put his hands on me. Yeah, yeah. anything or, 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 or just... No, 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 I ain't, I ain't know how to hit shit like that, but yeah. <laughs> what was but, that but, from? But, but, we love and hate. hate. <laughs> yeah, Martin was like coming up. <laughs> Martin came in like, what the now fuck Now you, Martin, you? fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's kind of like with Javante and the Nessa situation. Is that what kind of seemed like it happened? Javante. Because he was saying that he didn't oh, okay. put his hands on her. And she's like, he's going to kill me and call 911. Oh, and put the doodle on it. She, she yeah, the baby yeah. doo doo. I don't, cause that would. Who, so you, do you believe, who do you believe in that situation? I, I believe, honestly, mm-hmm. I believe he did it, and the reason why I believe he did it is because he's a repeated offender. We've seen him choke yeah. his baby mom in front of. I, I've been around an All Star game. Yeah, I've you been, get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not I, just, I not know just it was, everyone was there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, it, it definitely. He couldn't, she, he couldn't yeah, hold his character. I, yeah, I think yeah. it happened. But she had to clean it up because he had a fight coming up, and, and she needs she the child need support money, money too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not just the child support, but shit. Mama need a bed, brand new. I Bentley. need a lifestyle. I need a great thank you note for yeah. not letting, letting me get locked up. And yeah. to me, uh, you get more money when you hold it down, Sometimes right? That's how In it her be. situation, if yeah. she would have been like, "Yeah, he really did try to kill me," 
she, she's going up against him. And then you gotta think, not just you're not just going up against him. You're going against like millions of fans that, that don't believe you. Like, oh, this bitch got him locked up and they had money on this fight and all this extra bullshit. So you so just, just stay like, quiet. She's just like, all right, he ain't, he ain't rock my jaw like that. My, my shit just a little still, swollen. I'm a little, you know, I, I got that. He gonna give me new veneers. Give me a little Fendi ice pack, you know, make it real cute. Not, not yeah, I'm sorry. I can't. Don't hit my sister. I can't. No, that's a fact. Like, cause I, I like being in a situation. I really had to look, and I'm like, yo, is is my lifestyle more important than my life? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah. like at one point, you can just black out, and then what happens? Now this nigga done killed me. And but yeah. I got on a Hermes uh, robe, right? Yes. It's uh, like, a nice I'm, coffin. With I'm at the point in life where I don't, I don't judge nothing. I know how I would move in certain situations, and it's probably like ninety nine percent different than everybody Same. else. Yeah. Same. But if that's the situation that you're in, and these, this the strategy you in, I'm gonna tell you how to play it the best way you can play it. Yeah. You know. Mm -hmm. So if you're gonna lay down and hold them down, and and you know turn that lifestyle up for yourself, and not get the nigga locked up, and not get him canceled. Okay, bitch, well, this store got the hottest shit right here. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. this is how you get it for this. This is how you go. I just don't I just don't judge people on how they move. Like, mm -hmm. I want you yeah. to do the best. I'll give you advice and I suggest, you know, ways to move around where it's not, you're not putting yourself in jeopardy or in harm's way. But if you just going to be a, a fool with it, I'm going I'm to help you be the biggest fool, so, best so, fool you can so, be. So what yeah. you think about, like, would you ever get in one of your friends' relationship and it ain't got nothing to do with you? And you know that the nigga ain't gonna try to kill her or anything like you just. What do you mean? Like say if one of your friends. Her. Don't the, don't the friend ask for advice? She's not just gonna. Oh man, I done been down that road so yeah. many times. I'm saying times. so. Do you do you Woo, hate the dude the or, or do anything? Railroad. You don't want to do that. <laughs> you don't want to do that. You don't want to sit there and be the friend that now you hate the dude and all that, and then them two back together. And I'm stuff. at the point now where like if you call me with some BS, like your man's putting his hands on you, or it's just getting to that point. Yes. Call 911 before you call me. Yeah, please. Co yes. Hang up. Call 911 and then you can call me back. Yeah, you mm. can call because me. Because I've been the rescue you. ranger a lot of times and that shit done turned around and bit me in the head. Yeah, day. because yeah. Now, now they two together back again and then now you at the cookout now you and you, you looking stupid because yeah, yeah. you talking no, all this shit about this nigga. You're not even invited now. You're not invited. 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 You're not you are not invited you are not you are not invited you are not invited you are not invited you are not invited you are um, Floyd has a lot of women around him. He does. does he like? Is it a situation where everybody's his girlfriend? There, there's, there's, there's levels. Yeah, there's tiers like you know, like top shelf, like liquor. You got top shelf, and then it goes Peace. down. So you got tier one, tier two, tier yeah. three. Yeah, um, but yeah. it's also men. Not saying that he's dating men is what oh, I'm no, saying. No, no, no. Yeah, but there's men, men in tears. I feel like as well. Is yes, there yes, sure. men. Yeah, there yeah. is. You got your your regular do boys, and you like uh -huh. you know they just gonna do, and then you got the ones that are you know they gonna bang out for you, and then you know you got the ones that are Day like ones. mathematicians, and yeah. they, they gonna figure some shit out. So how does mm -hmm. it get figured out though? Like, how, and is there any offense? Because like, has there ever been a time where like you was around and he was like, "Well, this trip is not for you." Oh, all the time. How he moves, he moves like y'all remember the game The Sims, where you like build your cities, build your characters. <laughs> That's how, depending on how he's functioning. Like he's gonna build a world, and it might last three weeks or three months or three years. Peace. It depends. Yeah. Peace. But on a whim, he'll be like, move this one out, send this one this way, pack this up, and you have a whole new gala of people. And it's That's just a whole different. So vibe. fucking but you're crazy. Able to do that. By the boat load, though. Mm -hmm. Like you gotta think. Like he named his club the the girl collection, which by the way I built from the ground up. Bless I know him. that's Bless right. Him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he's a collector of, of people. And depending on his mood and, and how he's feeling would be the, the different characters that would be in play. So, like, how I'm does that affect, that. like, a relationship with somebody, right? Because mm -hmm. at a point, you're going to grow attached to mm -hmm. different people that's around when you keep seeing them or even you having... Most any... super successful people don't have an attachment issue. That attachment, that's true. Attachment will fuck you up. Yes. So when you think about the elites, they don't have that attachment issue. Because they can change at any time like this. They get married. They have kids. And what that mean? Michael Jordan. <laughs> what what did that mean? We seen it. We seen detachment like uh, Kanye West. They could be attached in that moment. They could be attached to uh, the idea of marriage and, and family. Mm. The but he idea. definitely got some other but shit. But they got things going on. For sure. So you don't feel Several like Kanye ways. was attached? Maybe at a time. He was uh, attached to the idea of family, sure. And having that it girl. Mm -hmm. But mm. it still didn't keep him from, from swinging other ways. I think he What's would the way? No, he, she means like going like, for someone else. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I feel like if she wanted him Which, back today, the he would go. by the way, I have a multi, multi-million dollar clip. 
Do you? Yeah, I do. I do. And what's that? What's this clip? I can't really say. But well, bring it up, like, Kanye. Hey. Well, he. Um, yeah, I got I got sent a little a little clip, and I was actually shot. Mr. Actually holding. Holding. Oh wait, so a uh, holding. Oh yeah, I don't think I'm shocked. I I I, I am. I'm not. <laughs> Look, I'm stuttering. I am. I'm not. Yes. I'm not shocked at all. <laughs> I expect it. Let me tell you something. I'm usually shocked when I find out the a reverse that somebody's small. I've heard <laughs> small, tiny. I've heard Lord not that mercy. I know. <laughs> I've heard <laughs> it's small. Lord damn. Mercy. I've heard. Um, Jesus Christ. Damn. Oh, it's one more. Damn, it's actually it's actually a big time rapper who actually got this shit extended. He's one of the first ones that I know that got it extended. How you a do big that? time it's rapper. Fat transfer. They're doing fat transfer. Yeah. Gonna, like, yeah. I don't know why I would think Money Bag Yo. <laughs> Small. <laughs> that he would get it extended. I, I, I he seems like extended. a type of yeah. person that would be like, Fuck let me get that. Yeah. Let me get that bigger dick. What, this, what the no girl way. saying? Ra, <laughs> extendo. <laughs> For praise the Lord nah. for giving me my little meat. Thank you. Wait, you would get it too, Wax. No, I mean, I enjoy my shit because I pump fast. So it's like, it's cool. Like, Not I don't mind. Fast. I don't mind having much little this shit. <laughs> like, you have no confidence in your sex game. I don't need to. I mean, because I'm 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 gonna, I'm gonna get the same feeling. I'm gonna still get regardless. So it's not nothing like to do with me. Woman, like a, it's a play. You I think you do that because you want women to be interested to see if it's really whack as you say. Yeah. I mean, if you tell me it's whack, I have no interest. Like I don't. But he's also I, stupid. I'm cool. So it's a little different. He's I'm not cool, like the you don't really so his demographic is the, the yeah, yeah, demographic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know. I mean, I don't that's mind. You. That's how Donald Trump got into presidency. Like his demo is the stupid. Do you see what I mean? Yeah. I'm not the king of the clown. game. Blessings. Actually, it's more clowns than they're, they're no, not. No, that's a fact. All right, so good game. That's Way less I, I, cool I'd, rather, I'd rather stay like this. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I got a little meat. I can't do nothing, and I suck. And he always wears high waters. I had. To I don't know how to look. dress. I don't. That's a lot of things I just don't know how to do. No, it's the last episode. Just stay in your lane. That, that's cool. And I'm peace with that. Bad. Bad. You know what I'm saying? His shits was like capris. <laughs> I don't know how to dress. I put the wrong pants on. Okay, wait. We done went all <laughs> over the place. Let's get right back to it. Um, let's give out a little more. We gonna ask some damn. Yes, uh, please. Just my, you could just say it. You know. Is Nigga, y'all say any motherfucking thing. Yeah, what for he real. Said? Twerk is saying that my chair needs to be higher. And, and didn't want to take for, for a whole hour we're recording. Say it from your chest. I don't yes. think it does. All right, now we had to stop the, the shit episode out of for a second because Rocky was chewing gum. I, was yep. chewing, I didn't eat. I thought they was going to have at least some pause. lemon pepper wings. Damn, that's crazy. We got pizza in there. Oh, shit. And okay. my guy is supposed to be bringing me some. <laughs> we do got a little pizza and shit. I don't know if there's a microwave because they ain't have a dog yeah. in that gum. Okay. So we're going to get back to what we were talking about in a second, but we're going to give one more listener some advice. Okay. Um, now this person. Oh, how did they reach out to SWAX? Hit us up on the Bully and the Beast podcast. Okay, thank you. <laughs> this is episode number what? No, thank you. No, why? Because we also like have five. a number. I was going to say 347 eight. That's a number that they call in and leave a voicemail. We so. haven't done that in a while. We yes, do ma'am. DMs. We haven't done it's number phone off. number I'm sorry. in ages. Okay, so go on Instagram. Hit us up at the Bully and the Beast Podcast. Yo. That's not even it. <laughs> no dog. It's just Bully and the Beast Podcast. Man, Rocky. Hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> not damn, Rocky is crazy. Well, I'm sorry. It's. Bullying the Beast podcast, you call at us. Hey, Wax, hey, L'Oreal, and hey, Rocky. I What's wanted up? to write in to get some advice on my situation with my girl. Mm -hmm. We have been together from the time we were 19, 18 years old, five years together, and one year on and off, and okay. living together for the last two. I really love her as a person, and she has a lot of amazing qualities as a woman and a potential wife. Yes, I would marry her. But she has started to become more independent. A more independent bitch. Uh -oh. And that's been fucking with me. Uh -oh. Now, in our current situation, I've been paying for everything. I make enough to support us. And we live reasonably. 
And so far, she hasn't had to work at all. But ever since her parents paid for her to go visit her home country to get in touch with her roots, she has come back with a newfound independence mm. and hard-headedness yeah. that's making me want to break up with this bitch. A hard root went to her. Said, half Eddie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we get into arguments all the time over stupid shit. This morning, we argued about her bathing suit. I said it was revealing and that I would buy her a new one that's a little more modest. Respect. But she got mad. He's crazy as fuck. He insecure. How you got a modest baby suit? Nobody wanted insecure suit? shit. This is what he wants. He want a turtleneck, long sleeve. Come on. Mm-hmm. But she got mad and decided to curse me out about controlling what she wears mm-hmm. and wanting to have her dressed like a Muslim woman. Oh, well, which honestly, mm-hmm. yeah. Which honestly, I don't want. I just would rather not have guys stare at her when she goes swimming. She has a fat poom poom and hey. the bathing suit Ooh. accentuates that. Ah. Wow. Now, my question I'm was... I'm looking too, brother. Nah. <laughs> Do you think I could salvage this situation or should I break things off to be fair to her so she could find someone who's okay with her newfound self? Yes. I love yeah. her to bits, but if this new version of herself is going to be someone that consistently is argumentative and is dressing revealingly, I would rather just start new with someone who is more into my vision of a partner. I would love mm-hmm. to hear from you guys. I'm actually not mad at you. I like that. I'm, I'm not, not mad, mad at you at all, bro. Yeah. I'm, I agree with you. Float on. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's not in your vision of what you want for your future, and she changed. And right. I'm mad at that. People grow. Every day. And they grow apart. Yes. yes they do. And that's okay. That doesn't mean you have to hate each other. That doesn't mean you have to force it. Right. Anything. It's follow your heart, and you are telling yourself that this is not what you want. Yeah, people right, grow give, all give different type streets. of ways, too. Yeah, give, give it to the streets. Give it, give it to the streets. But that's what she wants. That's the direction Clearly. she's going in. Don't don't sit there and tell me that you're not hungry, but you're bringing food out, out the fucking refrigerator. What the fuck is this? Yo? I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to be a hoe. I don't like that in my life. Yeah, but I'm just saying. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I just think You know what I'm saying? Okay. I, I don't want to be a hoe, but I'm out here showing everybody all my goods. I'm not out here, you know, having your way Burger King. If you don't really have all this food out here, then why you got the menu up there showing this what you actually can have? Right. You see what right. I'm saying? Stop showing all your shit. And people, girls say insecure. How about this man look at her as more precious and, and give her more value than she even give herself? But you don't even know what this bathing suit looks like. It might just be a two-piece. Like, he might be dragging it. You can't help how Respect. your body is shaped. Ah, and dang. she wants to go get a fucking tan, okay? And it went in her motherland, she got a good brown one and everybody gave a compliment. So now right, she wants right, the poom right. to be tan tan. Okay, so I will say this. Being with somebody at 18 years old, staying together for five years and another year, that's 20, what, 5, 20, 24, you know, because they're 18 and 19. Oh, peace, respect. Now you're Mm -hmm. getting into your mid-20s. Again, you are starting to figure out what you want to do. Who you really are. What you you don't want. Who you are, yes. She might have just been conforming to what you wanted because she wanted to be with you. Mm -hmm. But when she got time to herself she realized that this is what she really is yeah. let her be how she is and you be who you are right. and if it's meant y'all right. come back communication is everything yeah, you can't get on the same page and it's time to go ahead and close and, that, and that's and cool up. and that's always yeah. cool i think women only really know who they are after i think they should get about 35 before you get married both you know what i'm saying because well, we all got stages and ages you know i'm what not saying? gonna lie i'm not all the way mad at that yeah. Like, cause I think if I married anybody else before my age oh. now, I would have been divorced for, for sure. sure. For sure. For sure. For sure. Yeah. Now for sure. it's like no. Like yeah. you, you know where you're going you know in what life. You, you want. know what I you know. want. What I'm like, what I'm looking for in a woman. Had everything. You've had yeah. enough yes. experiences. You know. That's why I do think it's better to more. get married later on in life. And honestly. I say, well, me, I'm different because I want to get married before I have kids. But I do think you should be a little older yes. or younger. I feel like right. either you're going to get it, get her done right. or I, I, you should wait. I believe have your kids a early, but marriage should also be renewable, too. Just like a driver's license, any type he of says license. That. All the time. It should be, you have to be able to check in. We're going to check in. And I, see think, I think it's every life. single and year. But what if they be no, like, this no. bitch is fat. I don't want to be with her anymore. I mean, and Man, that might be, yeah, you no out. harm, no foul. Every year, we know every single Single year we're gonna renew our vows. She's not really fat though. <laughs> just I mean, whatever whatever it is that's keeping you disconnected and wanting to be with that person and, and love down on them every day, then if it's not there, you got to. So how often? 
Every four years. Ah. Jeez. Let me four say years this. is. No. Yes. I'm thinking oh, one. This is marriage. You don't every, play around. Marriage is, every, marriage is a big deal. So yes, you already sure. know that you're going into. Don't yes. play around. God, God but I don't think you should take it to year five. Five is, is, is strong. So really? let's go at four and be renewed and then. I think that's a lot in. too, Rock. How I, long I, do I think you one. Your license? Every, every, every four years, you yeah. get a four year term. I know. I feel like that's It's like the presidency. No, you don't. Yeah. No, I'm talking about um, your driver's license. Oh, your driver's license is what? Every seven years. Seven years. I think, I think um, a passport is 10 years. Yeah. See, this is so, you see how more serious it is? It's a longer time. But that ain't shit. We could lose our passport. We could lose yeah. our license. And your face shit. No, that's about your face shit. You know what I'm saying? I could change it. No, I could change. I could change the picture anything that I want to. Well, yeah, to. you could get another divorce. You just got to pay more in between the time. But I think, it, I think it, when you come to the table at that four years to renegotiate, if if, if y'all not with each other like that, you get to walk away. Nah. No harm, no foul. Every like, every year, if you do it every like, year, no, that's, no, that's, 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 that's no, like, no, why? Like, why because you, you, need, married? you need time to learn how to fight through it. You need time to learn that's how to work through it. your and, situation. And, and that's what and that's what I think it is. It's that's like, that seven year. I'm itch. gonna tell you why. Well, if they go by the seven year itch, that'll make sense this too. Is what, but what that's I'm saying too, though, seven years, right? This don't mean you can't get a divorce. You're saying that you got to get renewed. You got to pay for the oh, divorce no, saying, in between is what I I'm think the rules like should be. I'm saying you could be. renew your license or you could you could agree to or not you, renew right, and that's an nothing. automatic divorce. For nothing, no. I think that you shouldn't have to pay if y'all both agree. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. But in out. between, say from one year to seven year, you want to get a divorce, you got to pay for it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Big I think time. that that's how yeah, it should yeah, yeah. be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That would be fair. Every year so. we should sit there because no. I, I know why. You know why? Because I think if you give me a year, I could be the best person ever because I don't know I'm only here for a year. So yeah. I, I do my push-ups. If I got locked up for a year, I'm, I'm, I'm yeah, good. You don't want, you know, you I got, want to I got be I got a escape date. To mad people? No, I'm just saying, hopefully that she's working on her shit and want to love on me as much as two. And then next year, I'm like, you know what? This was a good year. Let's do it again. You see what uh, I'm saying? Year, Let's keep it? on. It's a not year always going. That's not be easy. That's an easy out. Yeah. That marriage easy is not out. supposed to be easy from I what I hear. You. I hear you. That's, I mean, that's how I don't agree like with. Like a job. You think <laughs> every day. <laughs> don't agree. Yeah, yeah, But yeah. like every I'm day you go to, you work a job, say it's something you love, but every day ain't great. Like there's right. some days that I, I have you. I work. You need some time amazing. to get your skills and your tools Somehow. up to how to deal with now, it. Now you know what, and I and I want and I want some type of static when I'm married, just to know that it is real. I don't want I don't I don't want I don't want the fairy tale life. Uh, I want the real life. The funny you thing is that saying? bitch might be like, I'm not renewing this bullshit with this right. clown. And that's I'm cool. That's what I'm saying. Because I don't want her to cheat. The worst <laughs> thing we get, the worst, what, thing, I call the worst thing a woman can do is actually cheat. A man cheating, like you said, that's kind of our nature. And, and no, woman, stop. That's a cop out. No, she I, I, never I, I, said that. that. She did say that. She Who said, said that what? cheating is a man's nature. She you said, said that's all that's men. Said her, all right. I, go ahead. I said what? Go ahead. I you said, said all men going to cheat. That's what they do. That's just. Now you said just, something about repeating. Right. They're habitual creatures. Like habitual once they're creatures, a cheater, they're, they're always a cheater. Oh, because I, I think that that's not true because you I was. I was I, no, no, because I was a habitual cheater, but a woman made me not cheat. It's the woman you who was she cheating, is. You was lying. No, 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 I wasn't. I Y'all get more slick and selective. You stay with the woman? No. He cheated. She cheated. No. He, she didn't cheat. She cheated. In my eyes, it was a cheat. In my eyes. Oh, but you said because your you eyes never looked eyes. at another page you got before. Eyes. But you right, said your right, eyes right. never looked at a page before. So, so how you know she you cheated? Cheat, you start looking at everything like some cheating shit. Like, well, I came from the back door. That's what I'm saying. So it, it kind of fucked me up because it's like, yo, I came from the other side. So I know what little tiny things is to well, start this shit off. If y'all want to know, that's why I was saying to him, he looked at a page before. So you just told him. My feelings hurt. Bitch. Oh, anyway. Where my camera at? Here so yeah, so, but I do think <laughs> that you owe a conversation to her. Don't just start moving on your life like y'all been together since high school. Yes. Like have a conversation, see how Please she do feels. That. You yeah. might just be overreacting with this bathing suit and stuff. You because that might just be an insecurity you have because she Stop went with out that insecure and, stuff. Because what I mean by that is she went out and stepped out and did stuff that you didn't, and now you might feel a little left behind. He said, mm -hmm. I don't like this independent shit. This bitch got to depend on me. Right. <laughs> like, right, right. that's a little if selfish. That's, if that's how y'all started a relationship, though, I could see how but that could be selfish. a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. That's and she's really young, to too. But, like, are we growing, are we growing themselves? for the betterment of yourself, us, us as a or, team, you. or just you? But you're there not you even go, allowing Rock. us to do it together because you're condemning everything that, I, I, that I'm newly liking. I mean, because you're walking around here with dental floss up your mm -hmm. ass now. Come on, man. Well, I'm pretty you sure that could be up a happy medium. You know? I, I, so, so people say bathing suits and panties. I think they're both the same thing. So, they're similar. Yes. So would you walk around 
your man's friends in a bathing suit regardless you had a pool or not? If I have a pool, I'm going in yeah, with a bathing you, suit. Yeah, we got to deal with that. <laughs> you got to deal with that? Yeah, it's yeah. going to be a bathing suit I, I, and the I know water. if I see my friend, my girl and her friends is all out, I try not to put them gray sweatpants on or something like that. You see Here what I'm saying? Go. And you're in Mexico getting in the water, we're wearing bathing suits. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, you need no, to I, get some better fucking friends. Because right. if that niggas is looking I, at I, my I, pussy. They so. are. I'm letting you know that. And your fucking friends, that's on you. Because these are the niggas you choose that don't have no respect But some real solid man be like, yeah, she she got a fatty. Yeah, that's me. Nah, but real solid man. Man is like looking at your pussy and want to fuck too at the end of the day because you showing him your name. I don't look at my girl's niggas like I never look at them you, like you oh yeah like and, you and I wouldn't like, do that either. I, if Cause I, you got respect for your man. Yes, and if I see her like that in a bathing suit or something like that, words when she come out the house, she gotta and, be a whore. I, I'm, I'm being like pool. this, but that's what I'm saying. I'm no, saying I'm, he's like that's what I'm saying. I'm joking. Fuck. What did you say? <laughs> I said she gotta be a whore if she's getting in a pool. He's like, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. That's exactly what I'm saying. Exactly. You get what I'm saying, bitch. You right? No, no. I don't think she's a whore. But I, me as a man, everybody not gonna be like me. I respect all my guys, you know what I'm saying, and the woman that they're with, like that sis. So if I see her in something like that, I'm gonna turn my head. I seen your picture. I was want to fucking scroll your shit all crazy. Exactly. Right, so what's right. the point? Like that's what I'm saying. I don't want my nigga to bring nobody around me that, that like is not trust. gonna. Yeah, right. he don't trust but and not gonna respect many, me. And many, I definitely are very vocal when there's right. a nigga I feel like is a shady nigga and right. I don't like him around. Well, that's and good. I'm happy you like that. I'm happy you like that. Oh, nah, I'm. Be- you think I'm not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, and I'm very funny. I'll treat the nigga real funny. Because he, like, cause he fuck funny. around with your dude. Like, yeah, you fuck around my dude, you fuck around with me. Nigga, any hearts underneath I, I my pictures? I treat most my dude's friends funny, just period. You got like, GP. to. Like, just, you just never gonna get that comfortable. Yeah. I was there cool. you go. He's, that's you what you're supposed cool. to that was fucking roll. Like, fucking friends. Like, right. you gotta realize that shit early on. Like, I thought that when I was younger. Like, oh, no, nah, that's my brother. Fuck out yeah, of here. That right. nigga ain't your right. fucking, ain't your brother, fucking brother, nigga. And that ain't your friend. Yeah. That nigga, you over here bend over. That nigga can't wait to go with motherfucking jump that's in that fact. shit. That's a fact. Niggas ain't you know shit. But see, that's what I'm we saying. We all Y'all wolves out out here. here. Now you got to pick your friends better, too. It ain't about picking mm-hmm. your friends. That nigga's a wolf. You shouldn't be looking at your man's girl. Like, that shit is it's just It's going to happen. These weird. niggas that out here is wolves. Everybody don't have the morals and values of it. You know see, what I'm saying? Out of 10 men. You want a woman to be extremely perfect, but you'll throw your neck on the line and jump in front of a bullet for your man. Who a fuck your bitch is looking at her ass when she's fucking making everybody dinner because you but, invited but them But my shorty house. be like, you know what, my dude, my dude <laughs> friends is here. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to dress like that. You know what I'm saying? Because they I know, not, I know they all wolves. I know they wolves, no, so I'm not going to play pool. around with these wolves. You said a, a pool and a baby. E- e- even, even, even at the pool, like I could bring, I bring my shorty to the pool whenever you want to, one on one. But if you may, I ain't talking about the shower. Put the shower, put your feet in the water, enjoy yourself for sure. But when you taking that off, you got a fat ass pussy and you doing all this type of shit. <laughs> yo, you giving my dudes a fucking menu, letting them know they can look through your shit and see. How, how do you oh, want to do it? That's my fault that your niggas don't have right. no It's my fucking... fault. I got a fatty. So no, now I can't go I, swimming. I, 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 I don't, don't trust swimming. you. I, I, I don't, I don't, I, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. I want you to still dress sexy, dressing your and your element. Just give a little bit more respect. You what know you what I'm want saying? Some bikey show? What do you want? No, no, no. I, if they got bathing suits out there, that's you know what I'm saying. They got shars and shit Ain't like that. They got that certain the things. Shars. Thing. It's just it is what it is. If you blessed with a little chunk, chunk, what you gonna do? I mean, you know what? I just you're right. You know what? Then it's up to me to know what guys are coming. Exactly. Around. But you got, they, yeah, I you take that. And you I gotta take be that. solid with yourself as a man. Like yeah, as a man, I know that men are gonna look. No big deal, but that's mine. That's my life. They ain't gonna touch it. She ain't exactly. gonna let them get close to her. That's respect. So, and, and I get it. You gotta it, be but... secure and solid in yourself. Yeah, you do. And trust your but lady. you also gotta know how it is because, again, me coming on the other side, I seen the most perfect woman in a perfect relationship. I'm sorry, not perfect woman, but I seen a great relationship. And this girl, you would never think she'd cheat because it's made her treat her so well. And next thing you know, she out here doing some bullshit. So my life and my lifestyle really fucked me up. So it's not really the insecure shit. But you can't shit. control that bathing suit or not. You can't Garmed control up, it. Garmed up, it don't matter. Because it you know what? The girl that the girl that got the business suit on and never showing that shit is the motherfucker one sucking dick in the bathroom. Because from what I heard, <laughs> from what I heard, them Philly joints, the, the ones garbed up from head to toe, I've had a lot of conversations with some rappers, and they don't tell me that Philly joins off wild yeah, they, and they be having the wild ones, off. three thousand. The hijab, the host, yeah. and no disrespect Ooh. to my sisters, y'all gonna do what you do, but. You know, it's, it's, it's no limitation out there. They, yeah. they're wild for the night. They, you know, they, once they take that, the hijab off and everything is going down. Yeah, you get what I'm yeah, saying? yeah. And the body be right underneath there, too. Body be smoking. You know what I'm smoking, saying? Yo. In the name of the Lord. Yes, Amen. ma'am. And then you think she more kind of like, 
Right, you it's know, been preserved yeah, from it. They yeah. not Ooh, out. She been busting that pussy open though. She was bust. They, they break their fast with the that dates. Pussy open though. Yeah, y'all look something <laughs> boy. When them rappers come in town, they're like, that's it. I Let them know. know. Yeah, 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 yeah. You can't uh, be mad at all that. Right. In the name um, of the Lord. In the name Sam, of the Lord. So what mm-hmm. else, man? I used to, I know we had a conversation once upon a time. Mm-hmm. And um, you had, what? what's up with you and Joe Button? Just not, in case y'all don't know, like not me, a damn and Ro- thing. me and Rocky was on Love and Hip Hop together. We were. Okay. Um, one of the realest. One, and I say one of the realest because there wasn't really many real crickets. characters. Yeah, super crickets. We she didn't like anyone down. the same. Like, the, whoever you don't like, I really didn't it like either. On, on period. Yeah, and still, to this, to this day, day, I still don't to like this these motherfuckers. day. I, make I don't sure. even like being affiliated. Me neither. With and that's, you know, that's my quote. And like, I look at you like me and you are probably like one of the only people that I kept a relationship with. Everybody else that I just looked at was just faking it's, for the show. It's funny how it works. It's like the realest ones are the ones that have a problem with the show. Everybody else who's just a messy They're mother. like, what do you mean? Like, it was great. That's the best thing <laughs> ever. And I'm like, what the hell? Yeah. I feel like I understood yeah. the Cardi B situation because she right. played how she was supposed to play, Peace. right? Peace. But she had a blueprint already and she came in with a team. So when we right. came in, it was sw- a lot of swindling going on. Like, like, listen, lot, this is not what we want for the next season. Because we came as the the second coming, right? right. Because it was mm-hmm. Chrissy, Emily, and them. And um, then we were the second coming. But they were fighting the shit. Kim right. Bella, and they were like, yo, we don't want that. Like, we mm-hmm. really want. And then, like, day one, we was fighting the shit. Like, yeah. I'm like, what the well, hell? This the is crazy is, not- is that they say they didn't want that. But, you know, when we behind the scenes yeah. of production, like, do this, do that. And but remember gonna- when they had me signing different papers saying I was in a... Yes. Yeah. Yes. They, I'm surprised you didn't fight. Well, and I even, had different papers that said, first of all, I couldn't even have mm-hmm. nobody within. It was something crazy, like a uh, hundred feet of the filming like in cameras. The city. Right. In the and city. we filming in Manhattan. My niggas is with their whole family and shit. Right. And it's right. just was, they me by myself. Yeah, serious. it was mad. Because <laughs> one of the people that was on the cast, I tried to say that I was in a gang. So that's what it gang, was. Gang, gang. Gang, Yeah, she said I was in a gang, so they were scared <laughs> and didn't want... That was like, probably the worst experience of, of my life. Yours wow. and my life. Both. I say wow. it every Horrific. time. I say Horrific. it every time. I, it gave me a whole different outlook on, on right. diff- so many different things. Peace. Especially for my, my situation, like... Me, Tahiri, and Joe, we came in together knowing what the storyline was going to be. And we you agreed thought. to it. You thought you right. knew what it was going to be. We thought. Well, what I what I really thought was I knew him and I knew her. I didn't know that once that red light on that camera comes on, people you don't know nobody. The hell up. Oh, you don't know. And they nobody. had their like it was like the Hunger Games. There was it alliances, was. and before you know it, like oh shit, I'm I'm the eyeball. <laughs> I'm the only motherfucker that didn't discuss this scene. And because I'm real deal, like they'd That's be like fact. line up with her. She got your back. I'm like, but I don't like this bitch. I don't yeah. like nothing about her, That's so I'm on fact. my own. So yeah, yeah, yeah. it's. It's the worst. And they push you because they push you to fuck with who they want you to fuck with, how they want the story to And it'd be somebody who you would never in real life ever, ever, ever fuck with. I knew almost every single person mm-hmm. that was on that show before we started filming except Rocky, and she's the only one I still speak to. <laughs> <laughs> yep, yep. And I didn't know anybody. I knew all of them, right. and I didn't fuck with, with none of them, really. Right. Like, yeah. it, was, it was weird because the only one I did kind of fuck with end up being the one I don't fuck with the most. And that's, I don't know what the fuck. But it was, again, like, right. you saw the utilization of being like, well, I could twist this into that. Yeah. Like, even realistically, when that girl put me in that book that sold, like, three copies and shit. Oh, that one, that um, one. Um, which I see <laughs> her the other the day, the and she wouldn't even Shut look up, my way. Still yeah. Alive? yeah, I was... The fuck? <laughs> yeah. What? Anyway, so... Wow. Um, What's so crazy is, though, it's like, it's been 10 years... 10, 11, and that's why we've 11 been almost if we count how long we were filming, we're filming. because people don't even. Yeah. And still, to, people are still attached to these storylines. I'm like, they even bring if, it up all the time. Even the life is a rice skin right, all the time. Even if the storylines were real, which 90% of them, they're not. Right? Do you but know why like, they bring it up, though, Rocky? Because they're stuff. fucking available on Tubi. And let me explain something to you. <laughs> when we signed these contracts, there was no royalty. streaming services. So I think that, that everybody part. that has a reality show contract from before, we need to all sit down and it's given class right. action. Yeah. Right. You know, because Somebody just did something I, I, I've like tried that. Yeah. a few times now. I've, because I've, I don't understand. I've because it ruins my life. TV. Every time a marathon comes up and it's like a new batch of people yeah. watching it for the first time, yeah. I'm back to being that person. You know they call from me. 10, 11... Oh, I got the they, they tried to get me to come. Okay, so they 
Yeah, they, let me yeah, tell you, girl. they ran down on me. They called me. They emailed me. They harassed me. Yeah. And the answer was no every time. Never. I said, that doesn't align with my brand Never. anymore. But um, so, yeah, I was saying that, like, the girl that wrote the book, never did she have anything about me initially in the book. Mm-hmm. She added that in because she was going to get a scene. Remember, she only did, like, three, four episodes. Right. So in order for her to get more episodes... They wrote because a fake what people don't realize is, is in order to get paid on Love and Hip Hop, you you, you, you sign be your contract. Episode. You have to appear on each episode. Which, by the way, I was the only person to this day to you be on, on all everyone. fifteen. Yeah, but I was getting kicked like a goddamn rabbit dog. In nah, this I remember they suspended like, me from filming. Yeah, yeah. When we caught her outside yeah. of filming. But I was like, I'm gonna yeah. get every single one of these goddamn checks. I, I just didn't realize yeah, I didn't. how how much <laughs> I, was of, like, I, didn't. I didn't realize how much of an impression it was gonna leave. Like, y'all really believe this shit? Oh. But it's crazy. Like the ones that um, those that could see through the smoke and mirrors, the ones that really matter. Like I got some major, major, major deals, and I, I I've been brought into production and um, you know, like film studios, yeah. and I'm like, why me? Like, did you? I'm just coming off love, love and hip hop. They're yeah. like, we can see through the smoke and mirrors. We know what production does. Peace, like, you're peace. ill. You stood on your own against an entire cast. Like, we need it you. It was fact, pretty bad. The first deal I got, I was actually um, the uh, liberal in a political show with Al Sharpton, Kadar Massenberg, and I was okay. like, how did y'all put me in this? Like, how did right. I go from love and hip hop to the NAACP in a political show? But that's just how, you know. But it worked are, out it, that it, way. It's, it's been working out. It's 10 years down. I got people that are like, oh, you know, we never seen her like hosting the parties and she don't be at the. No, because I travel to 47 countries. Ooh. Like, I've been living. I know that. I'm looking like, for my belt. I hate that. I'm having my belt no more. I know. Like, it's I've only 47 countries? Yes. That's like, I've been out of the, the country and, and needed a whole new passport while I was gone because there was no more room. Mm. I know like, that's right. Yeah. So, yeah. so did Floyd expedite the passport? Flo- <laughs> Floyd, is a, Floyd is an amazing person when it comes Blessings. to, um you know, being generous and, and giving people experiences. And I know people have their ideas of who he is and who... But there's Jeez. one thing I will forever be grateful. I went to places that I would never, I don't care how rich I am, I would never say, oh, I'm going to go to Schlossenburg, Germany. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, I've been to places that were never on, on, on my list of places to go. So I'll always be grateful for that. Do you but still, also going private, too, is an amazing It's thing. a total like, different experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So different do y'all life. still, do you still hang out with him? Or? Not hang out per se. Right now he's in the middle of his Sims yeah. And he's growing and he's evolving. He and I, actually, my birthday's on Friday. We share the Bless same us. exact birthday. No wow. way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the, actually, it's the last... Christmas? I, I see, February right? 24th. Oh. Um, the last, Did he just say Christmas? Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, Christmas he's stuck in, in the time. But it's okay. Uh-huh. It happens. Um, but uh, so while I was working with Floyd, um, the last, what, eight years, eight years, Eight birthdays. My birthday was completely canceled because I was part of like his planning committee, and it all That's becomes a whole birthday all about yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all about. I'm like, y'all don't got to give me no birthday cake, no nothing. But I know that you know it's gonna You're be gonna extended. Be good. The good. niceties yeah. and mm-hmm. general generosity. Shit, be, that would yeah. be my damn birthday. Especially if you have the same birthday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I live. I lived an amazing last decade. Honestly, Blessing. that's like, fire. I went under. I went underground. I didn't feel like the public deserved me anymore. Mm-hmm. Like. So my dream as a child was always to be like the biggest on radio. Radio was always my my shit. And mm-hmm. so this is Wendy Williams and Angie Martinez. And I'm like, okay. oh, I want to be there when I grow up. And then I did Love and Hip Hop and I got a taste of, of how nasty the public could be. And for no it wasn't reason. What you thought. And I was like, hold on, I don't deserve that. So instead of me fighting in that uphill battle, I was just like, you know, I'm gonna do something else and I'm talented in many different ways. So I just worked all my talents to the best of my ability. And when cool. I tell you I've come up, I haven't missed a meal. Praise you know, um uh-huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm perked up. I got perks. Not wait, hold on, wait, wait, wait. Nowadays you Yeah, perks. Perk, perk, perk. <laughs> no, 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 I was about to say, yeah, you didn't know. Oh, no, 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 no. Perks has the benefits, P R K S. Perks. But um, so all right, we mentioned Joe really quickly, and I do wanna uh, touch on that. We're gonna wrap up the episode after we do Wax's ABCs, of uh-huh. course. But um, 
So do do y'all have any communication? Because when you came in, you was like one of his best friends yeah. to the show. And I know y'all went through different things. He went through a lot. He kind of put his hands on you. Am he I did. crazy? He that did. was like he on did. the love and hip hop. They didn't really do much about that. No, they, they did, did not. They did do a little something when Consequence swung on him, right? It was, I don't, I remember right. briefly, but not really. It was weird because at that time, um, he was heavily on drugs. And um, so I forgave him. I have a forgiving heart. And um, we went through a, a lot of shit back and forth with like, okay, we're best friends. We're not best friends. He's 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 a head case. And I'm yeah. someone that likes uh-huh. to study people and try to figure them out and analyze them. Like, I can fix this dark motherfucker. Uh, like, oh, you he, want he from own. the dark side. So I'm always <laughs> them. I'm that. Miss I'm Fix like, It. Miss Fix It. I'm like the Oracle. I'm like, I'm that person. Uh-huh. So I got to a point where it just was, um, it was just a little bit too chaotic for me in his last situation with yeah. um, that came to light with his baby moms who I was cool with and, yeah. and I played the, the rescue ranger for her too and that, that backfires after I was like that oh, always good. happens right? yeah. was he bisexual then um, as far as I'm concerned he's a fluid man Okay, and so I, you already knew that. So I said this on Hot 97 10 years ago and it was like why would you say that about him? I, I always called him my gay bestie and what's so funny is um and this isn't a revelation. He, I, I know. No, he said things on his own podcast. Yeah, and I'm asking because sometimes he plays it off like he's joking, but then when he but said that, I would have broke his ass in half talking that's about his little talent. That's his skill. Like Look, he's, Black, he's Did able you hear to that say, episode? No, I didn't. Um, yeah, he, he said, said no, he would have broke Little Fizz's ass in half had he seen I believe a picture of his asshole earlier. Have you ever heard anyone I thought, screaming I thought he, from I, the If bedroom? you had said that, he said that, I would think that he's talking about fighting. Like, yo, what the no, fuck are you doing? No, he was wow. showing his asshole, his, a picture of his asshole leak. Why he showing? Why he want to look at that? Fizz? Yeah, well, because he likes men as well, I guess. So he so- smashed him, he gets smashed. Is he sucking I guess or he if getting you're sucked? saying you would have broke him in half, you got to be the top, right? Well, I think things could be interchangeable. That's true as well. Get out of so here. So that's your first thought, I just would think like Here's that's a top thing. That, that is a talent of his where he's able to tell you like some real bold face truth. Like, <laughs> oh yeah, I, 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 didn't, I didn't punch her in the stomach. I grazed the side of her ribs. And, and nah. then everyone's like, oh, he's just joking. I don't know what nah. type of Jedi mind trick he got going on in the world, but um, it works for his benefit. But I will say, um, what's so funny is, have I ever witnessed him with a man? No, but, you know, I know what I know. Um, but what is so funny is, I think it was season, whatever season he went back to Love and Hip Hop, mm. I had producers on my line every day like, and this is real shit. Hey, I know you don't like the franchise, but we got a dude from Jersey City who wants to come on the show and want to say that he used to suck my... For some drugs back in the day, and we'll line. That's how no. hard they was going. So like, if I had a real beef, I'd have been like, "Woo, this is it. This is what I need my contract to be." Because I would have been usher ushering that situation in. But I was just like, "That's messy as hell." See, I be thinking that because I'm like, I know Maul used to be around a lot, and I just like, <laughs> I wonder where he was. Because you know when you're upset with someone. And uh-huh. you be having all day deep dark secrets. Obviously, it'd be wack yeah. as hell to you tell them. But yeah. I know you don't do stuff like no. that. Yeah. But what I'm saying is what you yourself. think in your mind. Right, <laughs> right, like right. The shit you I think you. is those, the funniest. Those, those two is, yeah. Because y'all yeah. are still, are you cool with Moss? I'm, I'm cool with Maul. Yeah. And, and, yeah. Yeah. We're but, cool. We cool. Sure. You was an asshole the first time I met. I, I'm I sure I was. Really and I'm sure, I don't even know what like I did, but, really but all these like girls call me two. asshole. L'Oreal, you call me happened. asshole when I first well, met you. Because I don't you. even like you. Same. But you understand what <laughs> I'm trying to tell you. I think you feeling yourself at that time. I think you was just like coming out. Tax is, by the way, shout out to Tax. Um, well, no. We had a... No. Uh, Never shout out Tax. Oh, uh, why? But, but, so I, it was, it was me and, it was me and him together. I know through you. I never know exactly. I know him. No. Well, so, oh, say, so what happened? And that's how me a lot him of was together. Know tax, FYI, be clear. In fact, the white dude who was running loudspeaker at the time tried linking me and you up. Shout out, Chris. Chris, what up? Chris, right? Marvel, the Mr. Marvel. It's all right? good, though. Baby. We get <laughs> it. Like, I'm, I'm waxing. It was just extra. I'm like, mm. when would I do that? I never said this that. Was in, there was a, this was a movie theater in New Jersey. There was some premiere, some movie premiere. This is okay. eons ago. I'm sure it had I was to just be. like, I don't like this kid. I don't do and no he, show with him. But hold on, did, did, did he? <laughs> <laughs> That's what I was on. But who told you that? I never said that. 
You never said what? That I'm wax. You ain't hear that you from me. You 100% did. I said that. And, and at that time, I was cool with tax. I'm like, look at this nigga talking about he wax in his tax. I'm like, you didn't get this fraud up out here. That's how I felt about you. But God bless That's you. You fucked evolved. up that like, you even I'm said proud. that about me. I'm proud because of you. Because I don't even evolved. think I even said that. I never you said did. that to you. You did. I said that to you. All you I know did. is wax is an asshole. Oh, I am. Listen. Wax is an asshole, but most people always say that for me. I never liked tax for real. Like, tax was around people that I knew uh -huh. and that was it and after I was around him being around the people that I knew right. I decided I didn't like him mm -hmm. so I stopped fucking with the people that I knew and the because, whole crew yeah because okay. he was around I just I did not I did not like him he's well aware I've made a clear tax. I don't fuck with you. Damn. I don't care what happens to you. I need to shut up. Okay. Let me well, Rocky. God bless everybody. No. Yes. <laughs> Rocky, so let's get into I apologize ABC. to you for being an asshole. There we go. And, and, you know apology. what? And I've been an asshole to Lori my very first time I met and her. And I still too. don't like his ass. You see what I'm saying? So I'm happy that you said that you're, I mean, you accept my apology. Yeah, heart. I know. But I came here with it. the intentions of telling you you were an asshole. And I'm, I'm I really apologizing because you know what? I'm so yeah. sorry. I, I, I can't even believe myself. I yeah. love that. But you evolved. You sure that somebody ain't tell me he something or something? Evolve. Somebody told me something. There's no he way you said... He's gonna evolve up in here while I'm up in here. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Right? Yes, ma and that's ma what we And I'm apologize again. Please Thank forgive God. me. I appreciate it. Yes, so we gonna do Wax's ABCs because yes. we What did, does that mean? We just ruined black excellence by talking about tax. <laughs> so, uh, Jesus Christ. We might as well go into Wax's <laughs> ABCs. <laughs> Try, man. Now, <laughs> yeah, I tried. people right. are so tough in weird situations and be lying and making stories up, child, but whatever y'all want to believe. Uh, <laughs> On that note. Let's get into this. Wax is ABC. What's that mean? On a light note. Okay, so what this is, Rocky, mm -hmm. we give it's Wax easy. a word. He has to pronounce it. Mm -hmm. He has to uh, make a definition of it because he's... It's not going to be the real one. So okay. we're going to say make a definition. And he's going to use it in a sentence. Okay. Okay. Uh, sometimes we make him use it in a song. Okay. I'm interested to see what he's going to say out of this one. And then we'll see if we do a song or not. Okay. So you ready? All right. It's uh, P-H-A-L-L-U-S. All right. This is, it don't have an A-E-I-O-U at the end. So that P is not silent. So that's p hall us. Pahals. P Hall us. So that's P. Um, that's he probably work P at P work at U Hall. No Quality P. control. <laughs> yeah, P, no P, P walk at uh, uh, U Hall, and <laughs> they haul people. That's just like a. a <laughs> oh, you haul people like a bus. <laughs> yeah, so they hauling us. It's like you know, for us, by us, and this right here is a U Haul that um. It's like their slogan. They are haul people. So like a black bus? Because you said for us, by us. So that's FUBU. That's FUBU. But this right here is like a Arabian one. So this is like the... <laughs> they, this is p haul us. Us, us. Because p haul us is like, like UPS... U Haul and they hauling people. So that oh, thing U, UPS and and, and uh U Haul got together. My head hurt. And they sit there and they hauling people instead of having like all these packages and all that type of that stuff. That sound real crazy. Okay. What you talking about? That's the real shit. Okay. Well, can you let him know what it oh, um so are the you definition. Gonna... All right. Uh oh sentence. Sentence. Because that was the definition. The definition you said they, they both of them got together. All right, so I went to Afghanistan to go over there to smoke. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I went over there to smoke some weed. I ain't never been. And so Can you, you got to go. Their weed is unbelievable. <laughs> so, but when I went there, I seen like a, a thing that looked like a U-Haul UPS uh, truck, but they was like, nah, that's the caps. Mm -hmm. So that that over there is the PLS is the thing. So they, they, they grab people. <laughs> PLS. So so P you know you know how out here they be like. Taxi, you know what I'm saying? Remember the Harlem Nights? He's like, T -t 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 -t. He's yeah. like taxi, you gotta call them. So it was P. Hollis. So when I went out, put my hand up, they're like, call it P. Hollis. And that's what it was. It was a UPS. So I thought this was a sentence. This became a story. It's but it's okay. it's okay. It's okay. I'm trying to tell you, sometimes <laughs> I never know what, if he's still Where giving the definition. <laughs> I don't know if this is a, a book. It's just, what is, what is this twerk? The word is phallus. 
How? Is and that like it's a an F? Yeah, it's the term for something that looks like an erect penis. There we go. <laughs> I am a words <laughs> That was perfect. So they have phalluses in DC. I They're like it. monumental structures I've never been that this are wrong. supposed to like. You're appear so as a far penis. off. That yeah. is not even. But funny. how do you say the F? Phallus. Well, sometimes like a lot of people hop on one dick. So I guess that could be the, and it carries. And see, why it got us? Us mean more than one person. You see what I'm That's saying? It's, it's a threesome. You yeah. know what I always tell people too? They be like, oh, you oh, no, man. It dick actually is like fail us because that dick going to fail us. Because it ain't no. it's, it's not a real dick. I bet you if your friend come in the room, his shit going to get us. even harder. That dick fail every time. <laughs> You don't fail them. All right, we're going to get out of here. So, yes. Rocky, uh, yeah. so you are working on your own show very I am. soon. Okay. I am. It's, it's been in the stash for a while. Again, I, I came back and not knowing if these folks deserve me because I got a lot peace, to give, but peace. I'm coming back. Uh, my birthday's coming up next Happy Friday. Happy birthday. Like, she's accepting all kind of gifts, monetary. Cash out. We're accepting uh, gifts for her, too, as well. Bring them in. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm going to use it as like my rebirth. I'm coming back and I'm coming back. What about a Pihalis? Fuck them pajalas, <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming back, and um, I'm just uh, the name of the podcast is called Raw But Fair with Rocky for real. Peace. I cannot wait to see <laughs> and hear what you got to I talk got a about. Lot. I got a lot. You got some shit. We want you to come back on the show Please. because I don't Thank even feel you. like this is enough Thank time. No. Oh, and let me get my phone number out. Yeah, I want y'all to call you. My podcast is oh, about shit. y'all. It's eight three three Ask Rocky. That's R A Q I. That's eight three three Ask. Rocky. I thought she was about to give me all her texts. No, that's that's my real number. number. If you call the number right now, that bitch gonna ring. Right behind really? me. Yeah, I talk, I 911. To I to <laughs> you know what? Because at this point, for me, I like I gave everybody a chance to do their podcast and see what's really going on out there. Right. But Blessings. you know, I what I do know is that a lot of podcasts. They're talking at people. Like, they're the experts of this, experts. Uh-huh. They ain't been off the block. Half these Early. motherfuckers just went to L.A. for the first time in their life you two years about? ago. You understand? Uh-huh. So we getting, we getting all this type of advice from people who ain't been off the block. Uh-huh. So, for me, I don't want to talk at the people. I want to talk to the people and with the people. So, this podcast is going to be about y'all. I like that. I like that. I'm yeah. looking forward to it. I can't yeah. wait to hear it. Uh-huh. And uh, I'm hope- excited. I'm excited Wait, for you. Wait, this was a rapper when I met her. I know. And now Ooh. she's like a head of media. Yeah, right I don't now. know what's happening. I'm a changed person. I love growth, it for you. Growth. Thank you. Thank you. I grew. I grew. Now yes. I got a fat poom poom in a bathing suit. And got time for that my shit. boyfriend is trying to tell me to put on a cloth. Yes, and I, and I got a poor Hollis. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that sound like a bussy? Like, it sounds like that's a new right. word. For that's kind of what it is. My shit, the way it look is a poor I like that. Um, So they got your number. Do you want yes. them to follow you on Instagram? Follow still? me on Instagram, and that's Rocky R A Q I underscore for real, for real, right? The number four. I would number never four. had did that. Rocky's R O C C. Yep, that's First of all, he K- can't even spell. I- right, that's one. well. Actually, it used to be like that, but my name is actually Raquel, so short for Raquel would be Rocky R A Q I. So which Rocky, is real. That's the real thing. That's the real thing. So it's Rocky underscore four. So you like Arabia. And you have a phallus. And I have a, I got a big old phallus. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Bully and the Beast podcast. Make sure you rate, review, subscribe. Tell a friend and tell a friend. And we'll see you next week. Bye. My oh. I got a bra. He just makes shit up. <laughs>